Hello, future friends. Thank you for tuning into our show. We are Mistakes Being Made, a live play Dungeons and Dragons show from Portland, Oregon. Uh, we have an announcement. Um, all of our previous sessions are now on our Twitch channel as well as our YouTube channel. Um, and we will be airing replays of our Sunday episodes uh, at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time on Sundays. Um, if you're new to the show or looking to catch past episodes, that would be a good time to watch them, or you can check them out um, on demand through YouTube or Twitch. Um, if you're looking ways with ways to interact with our show um, in the body of every posting that we do, we have all of our uh, social media posts. Um, also, we have um, our Twitch stream has our, our, all of our contact information on the um, pinned tweet. Uh, we have another announcement that some of you may have noticed as Frank is sitting a in a different spot. Um, Adam needs to take a step away from the show for a little bit. Um, sometimes life throws more important things in the way, um, but we're all still friends, and he is welcome back whenever time allows. Until then, Corvin will be quieter and maybe drunker than he usually <laughs> is. Uh, so with that, let's meet the players and their characters. Uh, Aaron, you, we haven't seen you in a while. I mean, I've been here just invisible. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I've never missed a show. Who are you, who are you playing tonight? Uh, today I will be playing Bizago, the completely trustworthy bard. Okay. Mike? I am playing Cirque, the half work barbarian. Okay. And current champion of Rune Dice. Yeah. <laughs> Lord Rune Dice. Lord Rune Dice. Um, Lord I Why don't you say my name? No, it's, it's an ongoing thing. <laughs> so, my name is Howard, which apparently Shad can't remember now. And uh, I'm playing somebody. What am I? Uh, I don't know what you're doing. Are you playing Xenos? Uh, High Hill. <laughs> no. Halfling Wizard. No. <laughs> Definitely not. My name is Sarsarel, the submerged champion half elven cleric of Umberly. I'm Frank. I am playing Rin, the furbold druid. And, his, and Rin's catchphrase is Survival of the Fittest. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> So, quick note, uh, as far as Xenos goes, uh, Doug is home with his children, um, and they're misbehaving, I'm sure. Um, <laughs> I hope so. But Xenos will be back next week, and Xenos uh, will have some activity. And scars. Depending on how things <laughs> and go. scars. He might fall off the tonight. So, we're going to start the session with, with uh, Vizago, the tiefling bard. Completely so, trustworthy. Completely trustworthy tiefling bard. I've like been traveling with you a long down. time, and those words have never actually held true. So, I think that's true. Vizago, okay. um, where we left off in I'm Vizago's story, is he was doing a heist. I mean, some would call it a heist. Some would call it uh, the reclaiming of uh, distributed goods. Okay, <laughs> distributed goods. <laughs> Redistribution as well. So, um, we have not completed the heist episode yet through no fault of our own. <laughs> which is a lie. It's entirely our own fault. Um, but just things haven't worked out the, to the point that we could do that yet. So uh, Vizago found his way to Larath. Um, and here's what Vizago sees. Um, so we end the heist in the vault of the person that you're heisting from. Oh, Volgrum the Mighty. Oh. Um, and you... Uh, everything is going well until it isn't. <laughs> and the only escape route that you have is a malfunctioning portal. I mean, that's usually a good call. How do you know it's malfunctioning? <laughs> because well, it's kind of flickering yeah, a little typically, bit. So typically a portal would show what's going oh, on maybe. on the other side. And this one is showing a flash of jungle, a flash of a city. Didn't that shit happen to some Star Trek? Listen, I'm not going to say... <laughs> Stargate. <laughs> Stargate. Okay. There um, we go. A flash of a magnificent throne room. Um, so you are trying to time it out. Um, one thing that you do actually make a uh, make a perception check. Absolutely. Doug says right. his children are being very good. 
<laughs> that is going to it be perception. Yeah. yeah. Well, he could totally oh, just tell you what his action is. Uh, 16. That was the play. Okay. 16. So um, when you see the flash of the jungle, you can see a harbor area, and you notice a very familiar ship. Oh, the gosh. Hellish Rebuke. Oh. Or no, the Hellish Wind. Hellish Wind, that's Hellish true. Wind. So you notice the Hellish Wind, and you're aiming towards that? Oh, 100%. And then when you, so, and and I sent you a, a message before to ask you who you grabbed when you. Oh, yeah. Because you could bring one person yeah. with you. And so I bring my new favorite person in the world, Craig the Dwarf. Craig of Clan <laughs> uh, Rumble Tide. Yeah. And you jump through. And you do not make it to the harbor with the <laughs> hellish wind. Instead, you make it to a magnificent throne room where you, what you thought was a giant purple couch huh. turns around and it ends up being a beholder by the name of Lord Rundex. Now, if I had a copper for every time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You jumped through an yeah. accidental portal? Portal so, and ran into a beholder, I'd have one copper. <laughs> so he is quite surprised because he was not aware of a portal in his throne room. Uh, so he is quite surprised to see you. And he says... Welcome, guests of Lord Rundeyes. How can you entertain me today? Uh, well, I don't do anything involving children or pets, but otherwise, you know, the options are available to be entertained. And as I'm saying this, I'm scanning the room for exits. Okay. So you make a perception check. Yeah. Uh, that is going to be 19. 19. Nineteen. Okay, so you spot an exit. It mm -hmm. is in the ceiling of this throne room, which is probably about fifty to sixty feet up, mm. and it is large enough to fit a, a decent sized beholder in. Mm. <laughs> All right, so as opposed to a not so decent as size as beholder. Well, he is he is bigger than your average beholder. Beholders of an indecent size. Step one: find a beholder. Step two, working on it. Step three, escape. Yeah. It works. So he explains to you. Did you watch last week's episode? I caught very little of it. Oh, okay. So he explains to you that um, those who entertain Lord Rundines and his followers um, are frequently granted um, the ability to make requests of Lord Rundines. And... Um, those who succeed in his challenges um, frequently have their requests granted. So he explains to you that um, if you, the next thing up that's coming up is a race. And if you win the race, then he will grant you whatever your request could be. Hmm. Um. Okay, I can. <laughs> let me, me, me stick into the saga here. It's been a bit. Yeah. I can totally do that for you. But I will warn you, it has been at least a year since I last rode a horse, but I'm sure I'll figure it back out. You don't have Just to worry about that. Get back on that horse again. My friend, Visago. Oh, it's a ship. Even better. I am a skilled sailor. Yeah. So um, he. He aims an eye at you, and he mm -hmm. closes his central eye. Why don't you go ahead and make a, a either a history or an arcana check to know what uh, to figure out what you know about beholders? History's better for me. They're both the same, so I'm gonna go history. Okay. Uh, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So you know that beholders float, and that they have eye stalks, and that's about what you know. They have big scary big, mouths. Big scary mouths with teeth. Mm -hmm. And they could bite you. But they're so smiley. They are. Yeah. This one is very smiley. It's very nice. Um, and he aims an eye stock at you and closes the central eye. And you need to make a strength saving throw. Okay. Or just let it happen. <laughs> make a strength saving throw. Okay. Oh, oh Nat 20. Nat 20? Okay, so he tries to lift you up with his telekinetic eye. So, and you so he it does off. that, and Vizaka's like, <laughs> <laughs> right back at you. Because <laughs> he doesn't know what he tried to do. He says, how about I lift you out of my throne room? I mean, I'd prefer if you used the term carry. I'll carry you out of my throne room. Fantastic. But first I gotta lift your fat ass. 
<laughs> now, hold on. That's just rude. I know a fat ass. And I'm pretty sure he's still drunk on a ship somewhere. Maybe. So <laughs> I feel like that's just very rude and not a great way to start this working relationship we have. Luke says just let it happen, man. Just let it happen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And, so and he, he tries it again. Do you just let it happen, man? No, of course not. Just let it happen. Okay. <laughs> Uh, five. Okay, so you I'm just let it happen, man. <laughs> um, so he lifts you up, um, and he... Let me take a look at something real quick. Now, when he lifts me up, does Creed start playing? Because as writes, we're arms wide open. Wow. No, um, but what he does do is uh, he no. also <laughs> yeah, I'm a no. looks at um, uh, It's like Craig. damage, by the way. Yeah. Of Clan Rumbletide, yeah. and he hits him with another eye ray, and Craig immediately falls asleep. <laughs> and then he floats. Craig, you, you had too much to drink. <laughs> Craig. He floats you out, and he says, "I'll come back and pick up your friend." I'll never forget you, Craig. Uh, so and he floats dumb. you out into <laughs> the um, the garage area uh -huh. and sets you down. Cool. And um, Raj? The, uh, a dwarf, a mechanical dwarf, comes walking up to you. Okay. <laughs> and he That's says, cool. this is Duigi. And he will be your mechanic. Du Duigi? I'm glad we got Duigi. Dario. It's, yeah, Dario and it, and it's at this point that... Um, <laughs> that... Was it you? Yeah, it's, yeah, it was yeah. So you see Sarsarel walk right. in with another dwarf mechanic. And I'm choosing he, my vehicle. He has a reddish hat. Yeah, he has a his red hat <laughs> and these these pants with like yeah. hooks that come up above his shoulders, yeah. and they are also red pants. Well, your mechanic doesn't have a mansion, and even though says, it's haunted. He says, "It's a me, Dario." <laughs> the Zog. Do I have to roll to feel shame? <laughs> no, you I can feel go. shame with the 15. No, you, okay, you can you feel shame. Just, I felt it from the other room. So, yeah. so at that point, we are caught up. The two groups have reunited, and it feels so good. Um, yeah, I'm so glad you said it. So, I mean, yeah, you can't bear all of the bad. Right? So <laughs> I will recap what happened on last see, week's episode. See, like, roll a wisdom save to see if I can... So last week's on. episode, uh, the party met Lord Runites. Uh, behold, beholder Overlord of Lorath. Uh, they learned upon entering Lord Rundai's domain that they became his property, and he demands entertainment. Additionally, Biatch. they learned uh, if they won the ever-changing race named the Rattlebolt Cup, they would be allowed. Uh, they would be allowed the granting of requests. And Xenos negotiated an additional prize of treasure upon winning the cup uh, in a particularly entertaining fashion. They also met the following uh, super great residents of Lorath and servants of Lord Rundais. Yarp, the uh, Bullywug uh, tavern keeper. Uh, Yerp, the Bullywug uh, Random speaker, grunt guy. Speaker of Lord Rundais. Rotgut, the uh, ogre. A.K.A. His bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Alphazane, a former um, member of the Cult of Dragons. Right. But, but make sure we keep our cats away because we know with that guy. <laughs> and yeah. he is he is a no problem. Half, uh, well, he is a he dragonborn. is a black dragonborn. Um, and uh, Duskhide, which was a knoll. Um, and leader of a knoll troop. Like a regular knoll or? Um, a grassy knoll. Just a bunch of knolls. Just a bunch of knolls. A grassy knoll. A grassy knoll. Right. Grassy knoll. Grassy knoll. Grassy knoll. And um, I keep forgetting Maybe their a names. Maybe a sassy uh, knoll. <laughs> a sassy knoll. He Bowden, comes in and he's like. <laughs> the two uh, two human. Um, You're on a suicide machine. Marshall right? looking characters. They're not on a suicide machine. No, no suicide Hello. machine. Is that? Isn't that what they call it? Suicide they're tube. On, they're on a, no, they're on, they drive a motorcycle. And suicide a squad? Suicide no, one of the vehicles suicide is called tube. the suicide tube. So, oh, ah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Last week it was revealed that you guys had about a week to um, 
choose your, well, a week before the race happened. And what you needed to do was choose the number of vehicles that you were going to be racing in. Mm. Um, yeah, we figured that shit out. Two. Okay. And um, upgrade your vehicles because they came with just straight, they were straight vehicles, not really upgraded at all. Um, the participants who are left um, are several participants. They're, uh, they're the team of gnolls. Mm -hmm. There's a team of goblins, which you have not met yet. You okay. probably would have met them when you stayed overnight in the barracks because all of the barracks have, they have all of the people in them. Uh, there's a group of humans and then Doden and Bowden, um, which, who are also humans. Um, so, what would you like to do, gentlemen? I'm going to go to the bar. You go to the bar. I go to the bar. I order oh. up a drink. There's what? a bar here? Yeah, there is. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Matter of yeah, fact, so we're going to go to the bar. Yeah, 100%. We, yeah. um... <coughs> what do we say? So you go into the... Not drink. You walk There's into the bar. Thrill. The bar is called <laughs> the Stoned Bard. It's fish guts. It is, um... It is named after a very lifelike statue of a bard in the tavern and part part of the tavern while it looks still wooden is all stone. Hmm. The beholder um, did it. And you go in and um, the tavern the barkeep says, "Hi, my name is Yarp." I know we've been down this road before. <laughs> Three drinks. What's up with the statue? <laughs> is all him? He, he really he, pissed off. He mouths out to the Lord Rundice. <laughs> and then he he out of the barrel, he scoops out. Uh, as, as he says that, I lean over. And I'm like, did everyone else who mouthed off to mouth through guys turn into a statue? Because I'm going to be honest. I winked at him. He was cool with it. So if you're ever in a situation. <laughs> it is a bard. Yeah. And maybe it's an eye thing. So he, uh, he, he pours uh, a kind of brackish gray looking liquid into three stone mugs. And he Delicious. passes them your way. So I sit the one in between us. Mm -hmm. I say, um, raise your glass, and then I raise that one. I'm like, this is for our homies who couldn't be around. Oh. And I pour that yeah. one out. No, I'm, and I I'm slam it on that. the ground, and then I slam mine. It instantly, the one, as soon as it hits the pavement, it instantly starts to smell. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> <There's a tiny laughs> <middle point. laughs> that was actually pretty, pretty handy. There we go. Anybody want to start a fight? <laughs> In the bar? In the bar? That's what we do. Are the gnolls there? Uh, My the friends, the gnolls are not there. Uh, instead of the gnolls being there, there's a bunch of goblins that appear to be um, scarfing down food as quickly as they can. Are they is that what they do? Anything that would uh, oh. give them away as goblin, members of goblin, goblin, a particular goblin, goblin, culture goblin, goblin. group? <laughs> um, they are wearing very little, um, and it oh, does yeah, not. Brown, if you're looking for signs that they are members of the Legion of the Ember Flame, they are not. Okay. They just happen to be goblins. All right. <laughs> Which is the name of my new short uh, biography. They just happen to be goblins. <laughs> <laughs> so, I go, um, I go sit down with the goblins. They and just look at you. I just go, goblin, 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 goblin. They, <laughs> goblin, goblin. They start chatting it up goblin. with you. <laughs> Everything there he is. He uh, you. And yeah, occasionally, exactly. when one of them so stops, dumb. I just start laughing along with the rest <laughs> of them. <laughs> there is a I'm bugbear like, there that um, like, what says, he, what are you trying to do, man? What is what he trying to do? doing? Well, he speaks fluent just goblin. Just making like, friends? All right. Visago <laughs> taught him how to speak goblin. How do you yeah. speak common? I'm a bugbear. But where should we come? That one does. <laughs> how do you think we got here? <laughs> it has I a don't charter know. passage on a ship to get here. Oh. Just Did you know about this place? Yeah. You came here specifically knowing that there's... There's dinosaur robots. We wanted to come see the Ex dinosaur robots. Excuse me, what? <laughs> oh, hello. My name is Harg. Harg? <laughs> Wait, there's dinosaur robots. What's a he robot? reaches out a clawed hand What's to shake dinosaur? your hand. I, <laughs> I am Sark. People just call me Shipwreck. Wait. Nice to meet you, Shipwreck. Dinosaur, robot, dinobots? <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Hi, can you show me these dinosaur robots? Um, no, because we haven't won the privilege to explore the island yet. Oh, crap. <laughs> so. Well, good luck, because we're trying to do the same thing. Hmm. Well. <laughs> you look a little defeated. Good luck to you, too. So. Um, I go, Yarp! 
Drinks. <laughs> so Yar brings over drinks. Um, I go goblin goblin, and I walk. Over. <laughs> <laughs> like goblin goblin. Did goblins. you really say anything? Goblin, yeah, you goblin, said goblin. good luck with the future race. Did you not I, understand that? I don't know what I. I could have insulted them. They seemed happy. Wow. Well, when the drinks we come gave over, them they... drinks and said goblin goblin. <laughs> <laughs> and that's universally. Yeah, they know what you meant. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, I don't know why he said shit stain, shit stain, and then bought us drinks. <laughs> but they, he gave us drinks, drinks so, so I'm sure it's it. fine. I look like a clown, and then free drinks appeared. <laughs> All right, we need to get the hell off of this island. I mean, so clearly. I'm passing out. Um, this map looks familiar. No, it does not. <laughs> I made it up myself. Uh, wow, so, so do we have a multicolored rainbow rainbows. die that we roll and? Ooh. I don't know what you're talking about. This map <laughs> looks like a normal dirt racing track. That's what I meant. Yeah. Yeah. For you listeners at home and viewers, there's a reason why we're not showing the map. Because uh, Twitch has very stringent, non-copyright uh, protected <laughs> Nothing uh, copyrighted rules. going on here. There's not. No, not at all. It's, it's not copywritten at all. Those are just the lights that tell us where the track is. Right, exactly. Mm -hmm. So, so what, mm -hmm. how many cars are we doing? <laughs> this so dumb. We're going to do two. Um, do who's like in what cars? I'm in a motorcycle with Xenos. Okay, I thought you said two cars. Is that two cars and a motorcycle? No. One motorcycle. No, we're going to one cars. motorcycle and one battle one cart. One flat bed. Yeah, one battle cart. Oh, the one that goes 75, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to do the battle cart. With the flame yes. cannon? Yes. Um, the well, one you that guys rotates. can augment. You can, you can augment whatever you we want, want. Whatever but we want. There right. are specific. I know, we have to have work. specifics. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, but, like, you can't add a sidecar onto your battle cart. <laughs> what? It's <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> so, I'm doing, we're going to do on the motorcycle the oil jet augmentation. Okay. That way I can drive in front of, like, uh, Knowles or the goblins, and then and I feel right. like a go straight up James Bond or yeah, and then just take off. So, um, you guys have a week to yep. plan this out. You can make your modifications. Mm -hmm. You can also kind of learn how to, to operate a vehicle Excellent. in that week. So it we is, need what is operating the vehicle? Is that Dex or something? It's Dex or Int. <clears throat> if only there was a list of rules. <laughs> if only there was a... If only I was going to read the list handout. of rules. I don't really I, you see know, that I did hand this out last week. So and week. I didn't read it then. <laughs> <laughs> well, you should start. <laughs> ah, you got it, Mike. Well, product I'm not in stunts. your car. So no. Int or Dex yeah. based. Yeah. So <laughs> to drive straight is not difficult. It's not even going to require a check to drive. Okay. Where we're going, we don't need to drive. <laughs> <laughs> but, so, to, <laughs> to make a sky pattern roads formed by rain followed by sun. The, the checks are going to be like this. Um, easy is going to be DC 10. Uh, medium is going to be DC 15. Hard is going to be DC 20. And those are going to be interdex. They're going to be interdex. If anyone has a um, land vehicle proficiency, they can add their land vehicle proficiency. Only I had a magical jacket that gave me a land vehicle proficiency. <laughs> you know, it's crazy enough they're not they're not there. So um, I will try to learn how to ride a motorcycle. So <laughs> you guys I figured are, it out today. I'm sure you sure. guys are going to uh, you and Zenos are going to be riding on a motorcycle together, and he's going to be riding on the back. Yes. Okay. And you're going to have oil slicks. Yep. You're going to put a sissy bar on there for him? Now, Just strap him down. I don't mean to be this guy. <laughs> <laughs> what is Cirque's dexterity? 16. That's great. 16. That's not bad. What is Zeno's intelligence? His, I don't know. His dex is actually better than his intelligence. Really? And okay. I was like, a wizard might have a crazy high. And it's, in, higher, and might... it's higher than Cirque's. But he also but is going to do the ranged spellcasting. He can't reach the handlebars mm. and the pedals. <laughs> That's fair. I was just making sure we had this worked well, out. So That's the all. idea is that Cirque drives the motorcycle and Xenos casts spells out the back. Sure. Uh, so you're going to be like, he's in a backpack like a baby carrier. Kind of. Facing away More from like you. like Yoda. <laughs> I'm sure. Master Blaster I mean, situation going on. A mm -hmm. green alien <laughs> that is That's not Yoda. Sorry. That is a puppet. Year old, long -eared mm, copyright rules very stringent. <laughs> 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 so, that voice, nothing to do with any sort of character owned right? by Lucas. It's just a choice that you're making. Just a just an mm -hmm. actor's choice. What's your dex? 
My dex, I have a uh, 16, uh, 16 death, so I have a plus 3. So do I. So yeah. one of you guys should probably drive. Okay. I mean, I can, I can throw out spells. Can you? What spells do you have? What spells don't I have? And we walk over to Visago's many wheel spells. Um, <laughs> I have hideous laughter, which means I can make someone start laughing and not That's be able to control their like wheel. The one driving the vehicle. The like the one okay. driving the vehicle, right. perhaps. I have sleep. I have command. I have thunder Hit your wave. brake. <laughs> <laughs> break. <laughs> I have dissonant whispers. I have crown of madness. All things that make you lose control. And, you know, for no particular reason, I picked up heat metal as a spell. <laughs> <laughs> In that case, I'll <laughs> drive. Uh, you should drive. Wait, do you have to touch something? With heat metal, metal. I, think, I believe you do. You have you your own piece to. of metal. Uh, it's, uh, you have a component of metal, I think. But let me double check it. Just look at the I range will of drive. It. Yeah, just look at range if it says touch. Okay, 60 so. feet. Oh, no. <laughs> that seems good. Okay. Okay, cool. That's, hey, that yeah, wheel's, gonna that wheel's yeah. hot and now melting. Yeah. Do you want to do you want to touch it for a bonus <laughs> action? I can make you take two d8 fire damage. I have a wheel. Yeah. You know exactly. So, um, this is why don't great. you uh, make me mm -hmm. um, a persuasion check? Sure. Doug agrees that he is more like Yoda. Do, 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 do. This is persuasion, correct? Mm -hmm. Seventeen. Okay. So you actually find out the rest of the rules. No, oh, good. Because no one was volunteering them. No. Um, so this is similar to the Amazing Race in that it's not just driving. It is stopping, doing an activity, continuing on, doing another activity, um, and finishing the race. Um, so um, you have to complete the activity together, okay. the, the team. All right. Um, and you, not all of the activity, like there'll be something that's meant for mostly physical activity, and then there might be some mental activities and stuff. But if they crash and die, we don't care. We can we, take we all take as day much time as we need. <laughs> so, so the other thing is, hear them. Um, while the distances between the the activities is quickly traversed by car, or battle cart, rather. Um, it is not insurmountable that you could get there on foot. Okay. <laughs> and kill them. <laughs> so, well, no, what I'm so trying to say is... if we destroy their vehicles, they can still catch up eventually. They can still hook And then you run them over with the vehicle. Depending on how long you take to yeah. deal with the challenges. Just saying and how yeah. the vehicle got destroyed. Like, in a great, massive explosion, maybe, maybe, maybe like, don't make it out. Like, so I'll tell you what, I'm gonna go ahead and bear, I'll kill them on their way, go ahead and I'll catch yeah, up. Just have Rin jump onto their cart and mm -hmm. just go bear for me, just maul everybody. <laughs> yeah. like, oh, that, I'm sorry. Yeah, the motorcycle is now encumbered. <laughs> I, just, I just want to see a scene where like Ren jumps out and there's a car, and then the car drives back up, but it's a giant bear on a wheel with like one of those little motorcycles. Like, <laughs> I'm Maybe also thinking, the, I'm thinking a, a spider, <laughs> and you launch the web in front of the motorcycle mm, guys, so they just get stuck in the motorcycle. Just oh, we're going to have off. some fun with it's this. It's Indiana Jones style antics, really. <laughs> no gang. So you guys have got your plan. Yes. You've got your augmentations. It takes a little bit of time for uh, Dario, Dario and Duigi, Duigi <laughs> to make the augmentations. Do you have Dario or Duigi? We have. Uh, well, so I just want a clarification. Are we treated as a single team with two vehicles, or are we each our own team fighting so who wins for first place? Gets to gets to say what they want. Okay, and if whatever we want in is it each person team, or is it as a team? It is a team. All right, cool. And so if, if let's say Mike and Doug, Xenos and Cirque were to win, right? They could say, we would like to leave this place with the following crew. Okay. And they could name you guys. Well, hopefully my brother's going to leave. <laughs> I know he's loyal. I hope if, if you guys win, you'll do the same. <laughs> we, have a plus we need the, I need, There's yeah. like Sarsarel a 20% chance win. of that happening. <laughs> if Sarsarel, Ren, and Vizago win, Sarsarel could say, I wish to explore the island. And get his ass beat. 
<laughs> that's why yeah. we're here, guys. That is why you're here. Uh, I am here because of teleport yeah. shenanigans. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, the gods want you to, wanted you to join we us. We were on this told quest. that there was vast treasures on I this. I don't know what you're talking about. I mean, that's funny. And vast that's treasures are nice, and I do like shiny things. There's no such thing as an accidental teleportation. You well, were sent here by the gods. That's by not yeah. true. The gods Doug are. Doug brings up a point that I was having as well. Um, <laughs> what if we asked for freedom for all racers? I, I think that there is probably a limit is there a t- to the wishes that Lord Rundai can is I, willing to grant. Can I request for more requests? <laughs> <laughs> well, He's going the old can, school witchy. But then He's going he can the old school witchy. I is, he is yet to use. Let's on do some bramage <laughs> on you. Let's do some bramage. All right, so let's roll initiative. initiative. And then if the three of us win... How do we determine who gets to talk to Lord The bear. The bear. The bear decides. Oh, so that's, let's get this dumb shit out of the way, Sue. Yeah, no. Oh, good. Did you get? In our race, we all rolled poorly on our initiative check, guys. So, Howard, what'd you get? I mean, it's hard to tell if that's a one or... A one. Frank? I got a total of five. But you didn't roll a one. But I did not roll Five. a one. Okay. Aaron? I had what seemed bad, but now it's pretty good. A nine. <laughs> nine? Yeah. <Okay>. You sucker. <laughs> so, I'll just move you towards this side. Uh, Mike, what shipper get? Twelve. Twelve. That's a shame when that's Ooh. the... This is going so well. This is just the initiative in order for us to choose the enhancements that we want. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Rolling it. Among other things, yeah. Oh, yeah, uh, cool. All right, so Sarsarel's going last. I mean, last is a pretty... <laughs> like, what if somebody else fine. also rolls a one and then has, like, a penalty to their decks? That's uh, probably not going to happen, but sure. If it's a player, you just choose. <laughs> okay. So... Does anybody have an eight decks? <laughs> <laughs> You're like... You! So, the, the team of goblins got a nine. Oh. So um, I get to choose when it's a tie between uh, non-player characters and player characters. So he's going to go ahead and go up before you guys. Um, Seems fair. The team of... <laughs> it's fairish. Uh, it's fine. The team of Knowles, they got a 13, so they go first. <gasps> wow, those guys are I good. I am shocked. <laughs> right? <are> so... <laughs> Yeah. My friends, the gnolls and the goblins, and the only people I've really annoyed is the humans. Because yeah. <laughs> I just started asking you, him questions. I'm a half elf. Um, the <laughs> well, I just annoy you all the time. <laughs> These guys went there, <laughs> and I'm going to use Doug. Xenos as the fourth team. Doug's saying this is just a trial race, <laughs> <laughs> right? This is a warm up. This we're is all, practice. We're just in a simulator. Yep. Yeah. I don't know that that's true. Okay. No. Whoa. The damage is real, though. <laughs> All right. Did you just whoa? Yeah, I did. We're in the whoa. Matrix. Yeah, no whoa. Reeves style. <laughs> OK. So here's here's what, and as you're loading into right your cars, side. here's what you see. You see the, um, the goblins are in what we would consider a school bus. It's a suicide tube is what they call it. But it's a giant metal tube with windows all along both sides, um, a driver's seat, a door that that uh, accordion to open and closed. Is Miss Frizzle the driver or no? Is it a goblin uh, with a red? Is that like the wig? yellow bus Magical kids Ross. show or something? <laughs> is the is the uh, driver? And does he have an iguana sidekick? <laughs> he, might. he might have an iguana sidekick. Liz. Watch out for them. They have the ability to shrink at any moment. But so, only, only in if it's only for education. <laughs> Um, so <laughs> the next car, uh, wow. cart is uh, a group of gnolls. They are in a flatbed cart with a uh, projectile launcher above on, in the flatbed. So they've got a rotating um, ballista or something. Yeah. Okay. Because that's it shoots uh, gnolls discs. Discs like for the mask toys. Right. <laughs> Um, yes. And those are people who still collect those, too. There is a group of uh, humans, which you didn't meet before. They are in a battle cart similar to yours. 
And then there is uh, Doden and Bowden, who are on a motorcycle with a sidecar. Because they're not crazy. Okay. I kind of wish I had a better max bonus. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys all get up to a starting line. Um, and uh, There is one little flavor thing I have to add okay. here. When we first pull up, Kay. I don't think Sars Rail's in quite yet. You know, we're getting ready. Yeah. And uh, the Zago... Uh, you know, somehow procured uh, these like shielding rays for his eyes okay. uh, that look sort of like aviators. Okay. And he throws them on and he goes, Get in, loser, we're racing. <laughs> <laughs> and then as he tries to get in, you just pull the car forward. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> so, um, so Harong is, uh, so it's in groups of two all the way down, back. Um, and it is uh, Bowden and Doden on a motorcycle. And then um, the Knolls, shipwreck on a motorcycle. Uh, Harong and the goblins, and he's looking down at you. And you're like, what's up? Um, <laughs> and then um, it is the group of humans, and then you guys. So <laughs> before we get started, though, I want to bless him. Bless this mess. I want to. I want to cast. Okay. Um, bless. Is that a concentration spell? No, enhance ability. Oh, it is a concentration so spell. So directly behind me is the. It's either going to be it's the. It's either going to be the group of humans in the car, or them, depending on. What does bus okay, do? Who's, who's well, it's actually enhance ability. Well, no, oh, just, but it's but on the starting line, like directly behind me right now is the. I, I got it. Uh, well, so plus one. So you guys are. No, it would give in, you advantage in on column, next rolls. In yeah. two columns. And it's either these guys. If I give you cast grace, or um, whichever the one helps me with Dex. In the cast card is similar to theirs. Okay. So you can. Yeah, I want to make sure that we're. You're in front of the group of humans, yeah. not them. Okay. So Harong looks at, down at you and he's like, "I live my life a quarter mile at a time." What's and then a he mile? Shifts. <laughs> this is what the king. I don't know. <laughs> this is the king. Masago, like from the other car, goes, out. Learn your driving movie co quotes. Fuck you. That's <laughs> oh, my name. I'm sorry, I learned my technique in Tokyo. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You're going to start drifting right now? Oh. It's very difficult. It's With no speed. I'm driving. <laughs> Roll. Oh, it's an 18. Uh, you don't drift? So but as long as I don't cast a another spell that <laughs> requires concentration or take damage, yeah, uh -huh. you'll be fine. I'd be yeah. fine. You'd be fine. And if I take damage, I can make a save. Is that yes. a constitution save? Yeah, against part of the damage. Okay. So then I'll go. Um, I'll go for it because I had it prepared. There are fairy fire lights along the um, right where the, the two torches out. are. I'm also going to give you one. And um, so they one blink and down. And so it's a D from six. Red. All right, I got it. To yellow. To yellow. <laughs> to green. <laughs> And, and I just, it's just I use it whenever. Whenever you, I, so before he tells you whether it's good or not, but you can make it after you. Okay. And then yours is what? I guarantee you advantage on Dexter. Oh, Sirenscape. All right. <laughs> so awesome. Uh, you're supposed to go? Asago? <laughs> I'm, I'm driving. driving. Oh, Ren's driving. Okay. Ren, you're supposed to go. Okay. Uh, wow, that's kind of awesome. Uh, that's an 11. Okay. Uh, plus uh, three, so that's a 14, because I rolled 11 on both dice. So thanks for the advantage. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to negate that by awesome. rolling the same damn thing twice. <laughs> what you choose to do with <laughs> So between Mike, you and your guys. Right out of the gate, um, the, the suicide tube right next to you swerves towards you. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you can make an evade. Those goblins. Check. Gavin, yep. Gavin. And the DC is going to be 15. Oh, good. Right this. out the gates. What's your dex? I got plus three. Oh, do your business. Six? <laughs> okay. So your vehicle. We might win. Takes, <laughs> uh, takes six damage. Awesome. And it's bludgeoning damage? It is bludgeoning damage. So does that mean I take three damage? No, vehicles don't. <laughs> <laughs> he's got himself draped over no, it, so he's taking the damage versus the vehicle. No, it says damage resistance bludgeoning. Yeah. That's, that's like if you attack your vehicle. Aw. Like if I started clawing it through wheels? <laughs> exactly. Can you hand me a pen? 
pencil since uh, evidently mine got taken away last week. Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, Mike, nobody was going to tell you, <laughs> but your, your so bad the, use of pencils last week. The motorcycle um, that's in the Designing front with Bowden and Doden, it just like takes off full, out, yeah. full, full throttle. Um, it gets quite a, quite a ways ahead. Um, the, the flatbed cart um, continues. Uh, the group of gnolls continues. Um, they're not making any kind of movements, but the goblins are clearly fucking with you. <laughs> um, we get to Mike. What's Shipwreck doing? Um, I'm going to go full throttle. Okay. Make your roll. Uh, 22. Oh, God you succeed. Damn. Mm. Try to get an test. extra D4 squares. D4 uh, times 10 is your speed increase. 10. 10. So you can go 90, 90 feet, which gets you away, away from, from the, the goblins. Away from the bus. They and can't I flip swerve. them off as I drive away. They can't swerve to hit you at this point. Which um, What move did you just use? Just full out. Full, full out. out. It's only a DC 10, so that's an easy one. Yeah. So um, the the veterans, the, the human guards, are going to just, they're going to drive and they're going to try to go full out, which they do. So they speed off, and then now we're to Ren. You rolled an 11, so if you wanted to increase your speed by 1d4, you certainly yeah, can. Do that. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. Roll that d4. Okay. Oh, roll that d4. Yeah. Does uh, Vizago or Sarsarel, okay. So, so you're going 90. 85? 95? Somebody should probably uh, write this shit down. Okay. You want to write that shit down? I don't have the Because you got the battle sheet. card. He has the car actual so, stats. Uh, you got the car stats? Are you writing that shit down? Bizago. Somebody should be keeping some motherfucking that? notes. Did we get? Did we take damage? No, no, I have no, What no. our current speed uh, is, though. He ain't going to remember. That's what I mean. <laughs> I mean, that's just one round, though, so I don't need there's, to track it, right? Well, right you're currently there. going Thank you. 85. Okay. And he's got the same thing you do. Yeah. You're on the same page. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Anyway. So, uh, Vaziago or gas <laughs> mage hand. Okay. And I'm going to keep it with me for now, and I go get close to one of the other cars. Okay. And Sarsarel, you doing anything? Oh, uh, so are we adjacent to anything right now or not? So you and the, uh, the car next to you that started out are, you both are going the same speed. So you're adjacent to them. Well, I mean, I can try using the flame cannon, right? Yeah. It's not yeah. going to be a great attack bonus or anything. Xenos wants to flame bolt somebody. Well, Xenos is not here. <laughs> uh, or I could, or I could uh, try pull the dead on, on the driver. I'll you try pull the, the dead, dead on. on the driver. Yeah. Uh, have the the driver of the vehicle next to us. Okay. Make a saving, a, a wisdom. wisdom saving throw. A wisdom saving throw. Yeah. Okay. So that is these dudes. And he has a plus one wisdom saving throw. And he rolls a 16. He makes it. All right. <coughs> so, round two. Okay. Um, Bowden and Doden <laughs> going as fast as they can. They didn't make full throttle this time, so they're not going, uh, they don't get to add to their speed. But they're still going full out. Um, the group of gnolls is racing along. And they start, um, so they start blasting away with their um, disc shooter, mm. and you're the next one closest. So, um, does a natural twenty hit you? Sir? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> guys. So your vehicle, I'm, I'm gonna need that pencil again. <laughs> takes uh, nine damage. All right. And that also goes through the non-magic yeah. stuff. Okay, so now it's your turn. Um, yeah, Doug's like, what's the point of me watching if I can't join in? <laughs> <laughs> you can join in. I just get to choose when you join in. <laughs> <laughs> well, he wants to flame bolt the guys. Okay. Um, actually, if I... So we've got the oil jet. You got the oil jet. Which you can do right now if you want. Yeah, I'm gonna use an oil slick on okay. the guys behind us. All right. And then as their car, so they have to make a DC Wait, 20 are we check. You guys? No, it's the Knolls. No. 
with they're their disc shooter. They're going to through it, and then it's going to disperse. Oh, okay. Good. Um, so as they hit it, he's flame bolts it. Okay. So they spin out, and then they catch on fire. All right. So that sounds delightful. It does. And that's a 17 to hit them okay. with his bonus. That's fine. Um, so the bugbear, Harang, has to make... Oh, he does not make it. So he spins out. <laughs> and um, nine damage. Okay. Nine so fire damage. The the vehicle takes nine fire damage and it catches fire. Nice. So it's going to take roll a D6 for me. Three. So for the next three rounds, it's going to take a one D ten damage. Nice job. Nice. So um Royal Slick said them bitches on fire. So that was, my, that was my thought. He's gonna try to correct. He does. So he um, he doesn't lose speed, but he can't do any any kind of actions his turn. Uh, the goblins start um, peppering uh, cars around them with uh, arrows, but they do one one d six damage. Uh, let me see if they, yeah, yeah, they, they just start, arrows start flying out of the vehicle, but they don't appear to be hitting anything. <coughs> Fair enough. Okay, um, so the car adjacent to, uh, to you guys, oh, okay, that's right. So they're just going to try to keep going as quickly as they can. They don't do full throttle, mm -hmm. and now it's Ren and, and uh, the, the last car. What uh, are you doing? Before before we do anything, can I can I jump ahead real quick? Well, yeah, it would go to you. Because we're right next to them, right? Yeah. You got all go at the same time. Yeah, that's so. what I figured. Uh, mage hand over to their wheel. I'm okay. gonna pull it in the opposite direction. Make an arcana check. Absolutely. <laughs> do that shit. Um, oh, Ooh, maybe not. Maybe not. What'd you get? Oh, that's a five. <laughs> so the, the mage hand goes over there, but he's got a fairly firm grip on the wheel, and you it it jerks and the car wobbles a little bit, yeah. but doesn't. Go ahead and take your action and do something fancy, and then I'll gun it. Yeah. All right. So a ranged spell attack goes against regular AC or touch AC, or how it, does, just does AC. you have a ranged defense? How does that work? No, um, just AC. Yeah, it's just AC. Um, and they, if you're attacking someone in a vehicle, they've got cover. cover. Okay. So they, it's a plus two. All right. So. Um, do you have a fog cloud, maybe? I do have a fog cloud, actually. Cast that in the cab of the car. Okay. That's dope. They, do, they are in a, a enclosed vehicle. Space. Space. <laughs> that's pretty uh, dope. Let me yeah. make sure that's not concentration. That would be the only concern, because as much as Frank likes to waste it, I think we <laughs> need that. <laughs> Frank, what you, what's Ren doing? Uh, I'm going to be driving. I'm going to keep so, driving. Are you going to do a maneuver, or are you just going to be driving straight? Just okay. flat out? Yeah. I don't see a need to well, you do can, anything you fancy. You can maintain your, you can continue your speed if you make a driving check. Well, OK. Otherwise, you slow down to 75. Well, feet. that's what I would do is I you would slow do slow down a, to 75? No, I would do the it is keep going and going faster. So make a driving oh, check for me. So that doesn't, it's not going to work well. Oh, look at that! Got another 14. Okay, You're, you make it fine. Yeah. Just booking along. So are they still next to us? They are still next? To, well, actually, so they, you started, they've started... Well, started I wouldn't have pulling. done anything until no, after I, his action. That's because okay. we're acting So together. they're, until he goes, they're, you guys are at the same speed. Okay. Actually, they're starting to slow down because he failed his, so it you guys are... thunderclap yeah. joint. I'm, well, I was thinking about doing Thunder Wave instead, yeah. So, uh, I guess I'll just be on the side and do a Thunder Wave at the side of their vehicle. Sure. Hope to do some damage to them. Okay. Because so is that one, is that creature? is that a flatbed truck cart like ours? No, it's a car. It's, it's a, a car? vehicle. Yeah. So, okay. Uh, they still need to make a, a constitution saving throw, anybody that's hit by it. Okay. And so I'm going to have... It's going to do a push, like a pretty strong push, right. too, on the car. I'm going to have him try... The, the save that he rolls is going to be them not, like, Crash getting off spun the out. Okay, perfect. Um, he... This is a constitution saving yeah. throw? Um, he got a 15. 
So he doesn't he doesn't it. spin Swerve. out and lose a turn. Okay. Um, but you still do the damage. He'll so stay, the damage. And he'll still take half damage. So he'll take half damage. Everybody else in the car is taken full, and Which is the 15, car is taken full. So fifteen uh, thunder damage. Okay. So and they're they're probably hearing it pretty well because that can be heard from three hundred feet away. <laughs> Oh, Willow says hi, Dad. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that Amy's watching. Boom. Yep. Um, They've been thunderstruck. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and they're on their highway to help. Okay. Yeah. We, yeah. yeah. So. Go. And then we pull away. And then you pull away. <laughs> yes. So you're starting to. It's starting to become a line at this point. So um, the Mike, uh, you're the the closest to the front. You can see that everybody's starting to turn. So that this okay. this round, you're gonna need to make a driving check, a DC <laughs> 10 driving check, just to make awesome. the turn. It's not difficult. Oh, well, um, the first one makes it. Second one does not. So they start going off into the into the weeds a little bit. That's the the knolls, right? Yeah, the knolls. We're gonna want pencils. No, I just only. Uh-huh. Um, they they start going out in the weeds a little bit, and they they start losing speed okay. real quick. Um, what is Cirque doing? So Cirque made his driving check to make the corner. Okay. And then now I can still do a stunt, right? Sure. Okay. Um. Hmm. Stunt. Jump it. There's no jump. <laughs> There's not a jump here. I, okay. I guarantee you there is a jump. In this awesome. Race. Okay. So I'm going to just do full throttle as, um, Xenos casts grease on the wheel of the Knoll's car. <laughs> Just on the steering wow. wheel. Wow, okay. Fuck a bitch. And yeah, the DC yeah. is 13. That okay. does sound like Xenos. You know what? Instead of there being a DC, he now gets disadvantage on his uh, check nice. to make that turn. That's that awesome. works for us. Um, nope. Oh. <laughs> That's a natural one on my driving check. Oh, a natural one, you yeah. said. Yeah. So that, I believe, is a mishap. Yeah, it is. Which you is... roll a d12. Uh, yeah. Oh, hey, a d12. Get a 12. Uh, <laughs> is that a good thing? 12's... It's actually 2d6. You roll oh, 2d6. 2D6. Okay. You still want 12, though. So I make the corner, and then... Oh. Six. Okay. So um, you're, all occupants in the vehicle take 1d6 damage. Well, that's not too bad. We take five damage apiece. <laughs> okay. Uh, so so you, your see. vehicle buckles. At least you didn't burst into flame. I still have 55 hit points. So, um, I have 40 points. The knoll, I'm going to turn into a bear knoll. while driving. I'm sure that's going to go well. The knoll is going to tra- make his driver's well, he can't check. turn into a spider. Um, he actually makes it. Oh, it's well, good not, for him. Not, not difficult. As a spider, you have... Don't you have better as, decks? As I'm laughing, and then I go, oh, oh my god, this should be driving this I look spider. at the knoll, I'm like, ah. Uh, that's so dumb. So, there's this stuff. That's, just, that's eight hands to so drive you guys the vehicle. Are, you guys are rounding this corner here. Okay, okay. that's where you are. Okay. I can see a spider um, driving this truck. And you, as you round the corner, y'all are um, no. Like, that's dumb. I mean, the, the first pull off. That's yeah, dumb. Clearly, TM. Um, you okay. just have to make one more check to get there. So that's the Knolls. Um, the you guys are. Um, <laughs> Doug's like, wait, a mishap? I'm dying. <laughs> So you guys actually get rammed from the back no. as these, uh, as the guards pull up, they pull up and ram you. Are these the guys in the motorcycle? No, oh. they're in the, the battle cart. Oh, the one, these are the ones that we've been fighting with? Yeah. Okay, okay. So they they pull up and ram you. Uh, why don't you make a driver check for me? With advantage. Oh, that's, a lot of, that's a little bit better. Let's go ahead and get a 19. A 19. So you... You manage to speed them up enough that they just kind of bump you. You know they're there, but they bump you. Robert is um, And then they're going to make their um, their driver's check just fine to make the turn. Um, and now it's you guys. Uh, before we start driving away, I am going Natural to- 20 on my drive check. Nice. nice. Why don't you make um, an additional maneuver for me if you want to speed up or- Speed up. Yeah, okay. Uh, that'll do. Yeah. Uh, Oh, no, I'll take the 21 for speeding up. Okay, so you speed up around the curve. So I whip it around the corner, and I'm like, I'm, hold on. I Tokyo drifted. Yeah, I'm like, hey, hold on. 
Just wait till they see the spider driving. The as as so right before we speed it. up, yeah. the car, the you said we had the car behind us with all the guards. Uh-huh. Uh huh. I'm gonna look at the driver, and he can go ahead and make a wisdom saving throw for me. Uh, no, you cannot. Oh well, that's that's, that's really shitty for him. Poorly. That's just gonna go poorly. Um, so he's going to take. Uh, that's going to be four damage, psychic damage. Okay, four psychic damage. And then he has to use his immediate action to get as far away from us who are in front of him as possible. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's pretty <laughs> stuff! Well, he's already acted, but he will he will oh, move on his next turn. <laughs> Acting is scared. Yeah. No, he'll just hit the brake. Yeah. Um, you just stop. Mm -hmm. What do you do? He needs to make a wisdom saving throw. Again? Yeah. No, he rolled the same thing. He rolled the same. Oh, he rolled low this time. Same thing he got against <laughs> Zago. He has a little bell ringing and takes two damage. <laughs> okay. Two. Two. He was damaged. I was know. That? I rolled the d12. Oh, man. So twelve and three d6, and you did a total of six damage. I That's was actually six. really hoping I didn't we kill him because I want him to go thunderbolts. Horrible. Yeah. <laughs> Except yeah. for your driving. Your driving's fantastic. Ah, I can do that. Fucking guy. Wait till I turn see, into a fucking spider. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what you see is the motorcycle group just pulls off, parks real quick, and they immediately hop out and are booking it to the Something. the first thing. Yeah. Um, the Knolls, they're going to not roll well. Um, so they s slide into the spot, and they're at, at a dis disadvantaged uh, position for them. They actually have to run further to get there. And then it's your turn. So I'm gonna just pull up and yeah. hop off and So just it. make your driver's check to uh, okay. 21. Okay, so you, you get right next to the um, Bowden and Doden's bike and you hop off. Um, I'm assuming you've got a, some kind of backpack structure so that you keep uh, oh, yeah. Xenos with you. Okay, so this is you run up and there is like a, a thing that's blocking the view, but you run through these two barricades and you see that it is an American Ninja style obstacle course. Awesome. So that's what you see. Um, we'll get back to you. Um, Does all of us have to go through it? Yep. Everyone has to compete. Oh man. Everyone has well, to compete. At least compete. you got advantage on Dex soon. So, I've got a pretty good athletics. So when, yeah. all right. With no so when Xenos cast Grease on the warped wall, nobody gets past it. But that's not good for us. I know. We yeah. have to get past it. So, um, the goblins, <laughs> um, <laughs> they make their way the only way they know how. Making their in. way. They're also the not in an advantageous position. So they're not, they're not going to be able to get to the obstacle course on the Match first round. No one <laughs> um, <laughs> The guys that you've been messing with that are behind you um, go full throttle. Uh, no, they won't no, they because won't. They, they, won't they won't come towards go, us hey, because afraid afraid oh, we're right. ahead of yeah, them no. and they won't go the way so, we're going, which yeah. is so towards that obstacle. Full throttle. He so he slams does. The brakes. He slams the brakes and he is able to do it in such a way that he doesn't like wreck the car. Wreck the car. Put Flip the it. car into a skid. Yeah. And now it's your turn. I'm gonna pull up to wherever the hell we're going. Okay. So it's a, just a ten. Good. Good. <laughs> Thanks for the shit. And, and remember, <laughs> if any of those aren't a 10, you still have an inspiration yeah. to roll. <laughs> Good to know. So I'm pulling up, and then I guess I'm getting out and headed and for towards the thing. Okay. where everybody and else what is What are going. you guys doing? So do we following. know what like the spots are? Do we know what the spots are? Or are we just following somebody else? It's How do like, they know? So it's like, well, they've run this race before, so they're aware of what, what you can see. And the fact that they're kind of ahead of you is actually working out to your favor because you could rush But when we it. kill them all, then we're just going to stand around. But it's like rest stations on a on a So there are like signs? Highway. There, there's, there are no there's signs like, or anything? There's, there's just like a There's like a wider shoulder that okay. cars are parking into. Okay. Makes sense. Okay. So, I'm headed that way. So you're headed that way. All right, so you guys all get out of the car. You run up to the Somebody shouldn't, American like, Ninja Warrior. Well, we, we all have, have to go to, do to the thing. We have to, have to do the thing. So, yeah. um, but if one of us gets through it fast, we Mike, describe to me what the first obstacle of the uh, obstacle course looks like. So for a Ninja Warrior, it's usually stepping stones. Do you mm -hmm. know all kinds of weird shit? I <laughs> I could also have answered this question. Really? Yeah, yeah, no, what is, Ninja Warrior? What is the original Ninja Warrior um, 
the, the actual the mount, mount, the one on the mountain. Yeah, Mount Midoriyama. Mount what is the actual Japanese name of the show? Oh, it's uh. It's just Ninja oh, Warrior. No, it's no, it's uh. Oh fuck. Oh, Who cares? Like, Sasuke. Sasuke. Ninja not, Challenge, something like that. Sasuke. It's, it's Sasuke. Sasuke. <laughs> that's not. What Mike we're just here. had so to flex. You yeah. run. <laughs> that's you fair. You run ahead and G4 you have to jump channel. <laughs> from <laughs> lily pad to lily pad. Yeah. Yeah. So the rock to rock or yeah, Bowden and Doden, the two monks. Hopefully in a comical costume. Um, octopus. They make um, an acrobatics check, and it's a DC ten. Acrobatics, you say? Um, and they they're go. Have this skill cert does not have. Like, oh, well, it's either acrobatics or athletics. Oh, well, athletics. Then. <laughs> yeah. So for the entire <laughs> obstacle course, this is going to be athletics, uh, athletics or acrobatics. Okay. So they navigate the first section perfectly fine. Um, and then the gnolls yep. run up. They're, they catch up to Cirque, so they're behind you. Oh! Um, and then um, it's your turn. Oh. Um, so Xenos is going to have to make this too, or is he just going to be stuck to the back? Um, he should have a pretty decent I'm going to say that this is going to give you a minus two penalty if you're carrying Xenos. Throw him. <laughs> well, his dex is a plus four, so he's actually better than my yeah. dex. So, so drop he's him. Gonna, just let him do yeah, he's going to do <laughs> his own thing. Just throw so him. Just Stop with him. You have to roll twice. I just have to roll twice. Okay, so me first. So I got a 20. Okay. And then... You make it just fine. He's got a 14. You actually skip a few as you're Oh, he's got a 12. Jumping. So he... He I don't know it. if he has a bonus to That's a fine. Uh, the first one was just a 10. Shipwreck yeah. does the thing where they go up to the obstacle and they're like, they're he just judging skips it too. out. <laughs> yeah. And then he just jumps the whole obstacle and they're like, technically that's not against the rules. <laughs> <laughs> it's, not in, it's not in the spirit of the rules. Yeah. It's yeah. There's a guy that's done that. Oh, yeah. So um, the next group makes it up after you run your way through and then the last group is the one that can't come towards you. Time is all relative here because of distances and stuff. Yeah. So that's going to just basically wear off eventually. Yeah, it's going to wear off eventually. Yeah. So you guys, um, the three of you, hopped out of the vehicle and yeah. you, you're now to the obstacle course. Um, what do you guys? Whatever the obstacle is. Course. Check. Yeah, it's the yeah. same obstacle. Yep. It's the same obstacle. So I will be rolling an athletics check, and I got ten, a fifteen, twelve. Okay, so you all pass. So fitting total. All right. So the um, Aaron, the next obstacle is a little bit harder. <laughs> all right. What does it look like? It's a little bit harder, but not too. Uh, how many obstacles are there? There's going to be three. There's going to be three. Three. All right. Because the last one is the wall. It has, it has to, to be, be the warped wall. wall. It has to be the wall. Yeah. Well, and you can only make three the... checks on it because after your third one, there's no way you're making it up. <laughs> so, <laughs> well, because it's this is still stage one. Yeah. Okay. So rolling log. Yeah, rolling log would be a good one, or uh, jumping spider. Jumping spider was the other one I was thinking of actually. That should be more of that's, stage two. That's like stage two. What about two, the big though? red balls? Oh wait, that's like that. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's, let's go ahead. That's go a night in port. Log. Completely that, different log. athletic. Log. Where you have to you have to get on a uh, plastic <laughs> log and then that's roll a constitution down. Oh, that on the okay. track. Yeah. Yeah. I was thinking the bridge that spins, but oh, okay. No. <laughs> Oh yeah, that one's so good. So Bowden and Doden are going to make their uh, way across the uh, the thing. Um, they both biff it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, so they have to go back and start again. Um, shipwreck. All right, I'm going to grab that log and roll down. Okay. Still same thing with athletics. Uh, that is a 14. A 14. So you also biff it. Oh. Um, roll for Doug. Nine. Oh, yeah. Xenos also biffs it. What is the difficulty one? Is it 15? It's 15. Um, so, um, so the gnolls, who were, I believe, was the gnolls? The gnolls were here? Or was that? Like, yeah, the gnolls were there. Yeah, so the gnolls, gnolls behind us. navigate the lily pads, and you guys biff it, so you guys have to go back and start again. Um, the goblins, um, they'll have to do theirs. They don't make it. Um, and then um, it's your guys' turn. I'm just going to put these guys in last. All right. You go ahead. So I have to do oh, 17. Sweet, sweet beauty. That is actually a 20. Take your roll. Okay, so you make it. Yeah, Take your roll. I know, I know. Hold on. Oh. You got this something is, to boost your deck. This deck's is nothing compared to getting on a ship after a night of drinking. 
and then it steps <laughs> off. <laughs> That's impressive. All right. Yeah. So uh, DC 15 athletics or acrobatics. <clears throat> I'm not gonna make it. Okay. That's so you, a 14. You stall out. Okay. Frank, hold on before you roll. Okay. Um, this is a spinny log thing. If you had the ability to wall crawl, this would not be a challenge for you. As you look at how people are trying to do this. Mm -hmm. But it's a 15? I'll it's just run across okay. it. One of, my pro one of my team members has got to go back from the beginning anyway, so yeah. it, it doesn't necessarily... You just have to finish together, so you have to wait until the last person. Okay. Yeah, so he's he's got time. If he screws up, he just... You've got yeah. advantage on dex throws, though. Around. Is it dex? Dex was on the list, too? Yeah, because uh, you're yeah, diving. If you're doing dex you're doing athletics. acrobatics uh, or athletics. Yeah. Acrobatics yeah. or athletics. So. Oh, that's good. Okay, so All you right. make it. I cleared it, okay. yeah. All right. Um, so the guys that you scared... Um, they get to the first station, and they're just waiting. He, walk, he, he walks back by, and he's like, booga, booga, booga. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I'm not going to go to Frank, because Frank doesn't watch American uh, yeah, yeah, it's lost. I um, defer to one of those two to so give Howard, the next obstacle. Yeah. Do you watch that show, What too? does the last obstacle in this obstacle course look like? Well, it's a wall. It's but as you run along the wall, there's a narrow plank, mm -hmm. and next to the plank, there's a pit filled with sludge. Okay. And the same stuff that they cook. The past, same stuff they dish out at the. Things open up out of the wall and try to push you off I the ledge. Damn it. That's, the That's also wipe wipe out, out. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So Isn't it, it's, not, it's the same thing, basically. <laughs> the two monks. Oh, that, that hurts. What's little. the challenge on the I would love the to see the American Ninja Warrior group. Are you serious? Do the, wipe do the wipeout? Out? Yeah. So okay. <laughs> they can't, though. <laughs> because uh, it's the two monks. Yeah. Just like, I mean, like they were on the wind. They're just like. The first challenge. Yeah. So they're all the way through. And they basically. All the way through. They failed the second challenge, though, right? Oh, no, that's right. They did fail. So they managed to make their way through. So they're standing on the same platform that you guys are on, waiting for you guys to. Do the log again. Do the log again. The Knolls, they didn't succeed last time. So they're going to go ahead and. Yeah, they make it. So they are standing on the same platform. Are we allowed to attack each other? As is that against the rules? The battling happens. I'm just looking at this group of adversaries of mine. All right, Thunder Wave. Next, do you hear that? It's it sounds like thunder. It's really crowded on the platform. So you have two monks. A group of goblins steadily making their way here. That'd be awesome. Knolls, <laughs> and then you guys that have failed mixed in. That would be awesome. So He's like, could you get to my right 15. side? Hey, everybody, should nope. get to my right side. Okay. <laughs> yep. Okay, so Xenos is across. And Xenos is across and Cirque got a two. Okay. So nine. So you're back. So the so goblins. I'm so still doing the rolling log. So you don't start at the very beginning. You, you got to go back to the one challenge. that you, yeah, you have to, you just you have restart to get past the same one that you're trying yeah, yeah, to get yeah. through. Yeah. So the goblins make their way across. So the, now the goblins are all on the platform with you guys. Um, oh, it's my, it's my actually, oh wait, I put, no, yeah, it's your turn. Yeah, I okay. put the I put the guards to the last. Yeah. Uh, that is going to be eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's a twelve <laughs> acrobatics. That is not going to make it. No, right. Can I make a perception or a wisdom check to see if there's a way for me to do this more easily than the way I attempted last time? Sure. Does that give me a bonus? Sure. What's the DC of uh, perception? Why don't you tell me what you're rolling on? I got an 18. Okay, so you see that the handholds on the rolling log, like you put it, you just try to grab it, but there's handholds, and if you if you think if you uh, did the handholds better this time, you get a plus two on your turn. Okay, perfect. Xenos wants to miss. So that is a twenty this time. Okay, you can do that. Two, would you give? What's I that? got a twenty. Okay, you make it. So. You make it. So you're you're to the next spot. Can where I you're... tell him what I learned about that? Yeah, like, you can yell the rent. I already beat the rolling log. Okay, oh. so you guys are all. Oh, we're all across. I'm yeah, sorry. yeah, yeah. We're all... Okay, <laughs> we're on the I wall. Watched. So we're on the wall, <laughs> and I'm already on. So I can go ahead and make my first wall check, right? You yeah. could make your first wall check. No. Okay. <laughs> What's the DC on the wall? Twenty. Oh, but if you were a spider. 
But if you're a spider, you could just walk right yeah. in. Yeah. But then and then we've got more obstacles and I only get two of those a day. Yeah. So and I'm not gonna yeah. sleep in the yeah. car, which mm -hmm. seems like something I should do. But yeah. Well it's not gonna take you an hour to finish this race, so it's probably not gonna not gonna work. Um okay, so Did we get the radio upgrade? Yes, we the, did. Oh, good. Good. The guards L -L -Cool -J make their check, they um, <laughs> they make their first check, so they're across the lily pad, so they're in last place currently. Um, the monks do not make the wall. They get pushed off as they're making their way across. It's uh, one of the comical a hands. A big block them. comes through and pushes them <laughs> off. <laughs> the gnolls are standing right next right. to you guys because they make their way across very, very okay. quickly. All right. Um, the advantage, but then it had to punch something. Uh, <laughs> Did you say you had to punch somebody? If I have rage right now, I'd get advantage on strength checks. But somebody's going to have to die. But somebody's <laughs> going to have to die. I would say for this, um, conduct it, uh, performing an obstacle would count as you being in combat. Okay. So you want to rage? Yeah, I've, I thought about it. And then that way it'll last for the two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the other obstacle. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got a 20, 22. Okay. Yeah. Yep. So, um, could I cast sky right? The goblins. <laughs> the goblins are with you, are, are on the second platform, so they yeah. have to make a 20. They do not. Um, okay. Zaga? All right. Um, before I go in this, Zaga's going to give himself a little pep talk. He's like, you got this, man. You got it. You got mm -hmm. this. I'll spend one of my inspiration to sure. give myself inspiration. Absolutely. You spend inspiration to get inspiration. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, and then I'm going to attempt this bad boy again. And you have a plus two because you watched how he did it. Yes. Oh. Nat, Twin 20, 20 on the roll. All right. Call out to me how the hell to get off the goddamn wall. <laughs> <laughs> you just do it. <laughs> So you Not see, helpful. You see him, he's running along this really narrow bridge and he, uh, uh, next to a wall and the hand comes out like uh, you've seen knock so many people off and he just vaults over it and yeah. continues I do a little. Like, do you see how big slide. I am? So, how, I'm just going to yeah. catch the wall, yeah. <laughs> catch the hand. Sarsarel made it, right? Or no? No. Uh, no, I haven't gone there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so Sarsarel and Ren, what are you doing? Uh, can I try again with the perception before going? I'm just going to give you the plus two. Oh, you are? Okay, perfect. Yeah. You just saw so me do it. You should oh, get yes. this. Nat 20. Hell yeah. What'd you get? Uh, oh, I got a 20. Okay. Because okay. of the plus two. Okay. Yeah. okay. There All you right. go. So you guys I got like see, a 27, like, actually. <laughs> oh, plus two. You guys see, like, your cars are specific colors, and there is a key hanging on, like, a lanyard thing. Oh, okay. That is the color the, of perfect. your car. So you can then... So we take all of the keys. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> You're right. We don't take all the keys, but I do switch two of the key colors on the chain. Chad, <laughs> <laughs> right. your bag. Like. <laughs> this is why you play this. <laughs> um, do you know what color what keys those go to? <laughs> Nope. Awesome. Just, just somebody. Hope it's it just a yours. chance percentile at this good point. Good to know. Mike, uh, is high good for you or bad for you? High is bad for me. Okay, doke. All right. <laughs> I know the result. Um, so you guys can start making your way back to Perfect. the car. And it's right. very much American Ninja Warrior style where the, <laughs> the, the, you just run around. Perfect. And you can make your way back. We, uh, right. we dukes a hazard into the car. That's right. <laughs> Um, There's no I mean, doors it's a flat to begin with. On the, back, so. <laughs> the guards, they make it. So they're now on the second wall. one. Oh, on the second one? Yeah. They're on the Are we the only ones? Yeah, we're the only ones. Okay, we're the first finished. ones through. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Um, okay, so Go back to the monks. Yes. Or the we're monks gonna, make we're it across. We're that a little bit. We'll, we'll get it by the well, end of the race. Well, Xenos is at the other side. The gnolls do not. So Xenos made it. Oh, yeah, I, I you failed got on this. mine. You got this. Okay. Again? Yeah. Okay. I, I got a 12. <laughs> the goblins. On my Aren't advantage. Aren't you strong? Yes. Aren't you strong? <laughs> strong? I'm very athletic. You see the goblins, they form. This shit confuses me. <laughs> I'm very <laughs> athletic, you say, to the, person, the hostess. That's yeah. <laughs> so you see with the color. goblins, what they form is what you would think of as a human ladder, but it's a goblin ladder, and they mm. just make their way across holding hands. <laughs> 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 Pull. I mean, so really, we could all learn a lesson from goblins about teamwork. <laughs> <laughs> right? Little and, scavenging um, bastards. Ren, 
Um, make a, you, you guys like hop in the vehicle okay. and make a check. This is going to be a 15 to get out of this roundabout. Oh, I'll take that 17 plus okay. three. I'll take the twin okay. 20. Mm. So um, when you're looking at the course, so the <laughs> obstacle course was right here. So you're basically, you pulled off and then you go into this. Okay. We'll switch back here. And then we're like, in a round about this radio was really hat, worth the upgrade. You can put on Frank to cover mm -hmm. up that eagle's logo. I, Frank, I, Frank will not wear a bear's hat. I do have <laughs> That would be D-U-M-B dumb. <laughs> <laughs> so, so many uh, Chicago and <laughs> Sarsarel, do you guys want to do anything while? I mean, I mean yeah. yeah. Let's, uh, let's like knock a flamethrower around on one of the vehicles. There's no other vehicles out yet. There you guys are, are you guys are pulling out of the parking spot. So as we're parked. Oh, oh, like, okay. So I thought we had already made it around the roundabout. Do a oh. round of flame on one of them. Like we can try that. I mean, yeah, we can you totally do that. Can. I mean, they don't. They can't roll to evade at this point because so. they're parked vehicles. Oh, so there's not even a. <laughs> is it an attack? You roll? just you just Wait, roll the damage. How, yeah. okay. how far from the course are we? That's in, 40 uh, feet. Um, like, in the car as we're driving out uh -huh. to the course, how far would that be about? It's could, probably 30, 40 feet. So uh, to shipwreck, <clears throat> I cast message and I go, hey, if you have this color key, use the other one. Dope! 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 I was like... <laughs> 16. You can respond to this message. 16 fire damage? Yeah. I can. Okay. Um, oh, and and that, that's the response. Before. I can't? Okay. Oh, well, all right. Well, we'll yeah. go. Not really <laughs> I know which right. one's theirs. Two. Okay. The hell so the now? <coughs> Dude, uh, that is bloody comical. It's <laughs> yeah. like, if you're using this card, use it. 16. What? Sorry. Why is Vaziago talking? My head. No Vaziago. <laughs> this is the scariest thing. Okay, so. Um, Am I hearing the announcer now? <laughs> is it on fire? Also, or just <laughs> just <laughs> cast a message to people's heads. The Sunday. reason this that oh, one was on oil. Yeah. Oh, he took a hard knock. And you know, we never went back to it. <laughs> so what'd you do to him? I, uh, I just hit 16 fire damage to the... He did the box. flame jets nice. as you guys were riding off and flame nice. jet one of like, the hold cars. On. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That's how we roll. Yeah, that'll work. So the monks take off. They start running back to theirs. Um, and uh, the gnolls are going to try to navigate. They do not. Uh, Sir, what are you doing? I got a natural 20 this time. Okay. Oh, yeah. dude, that'd be odd. Because you heard Vizago in your head. <laughs> right? I got this. Yeah. So you run. You get to the the keys. Make a wisdom. Uh, or, uh, yeah, wisdom saving throw. You got a 20? Okay, Ooh, so nice. you realize what he's talking about, and you grab like, the right key. Like, what? The? Oh. <laughs> okay. okay. Excellent. So you run back. Yep. Um, we run back to the cart. Yeah, you run back to the cart. And Xenos is right. Where the hell you been? <laughs> <laughs> right? The Did goblins, you see the other groups just ran by? <laughs> the goblins are ahead of you, and they're pulling out of the parking lot. I'm glad Xenos is too short to have grabbed that key already. He <laughs> would have grabbed the wrong one. <laughs> oh, he would have also driven away. <laughs> so um, this is back to you guys. Oh, okay. Um, yes. You need to make your um, your driver's check. This is a DC 15. Why'd it go from 15 to 10? Do you see how loopy that... that it's super loopy. You're, no, it's, you're up. Oh, this is yeah. where your pencil is. Yeah. Yeah. We're in the We're right not here. quite a ball sack roundabout. Yeah, it is very much a ball sack roundabout. Uh, let's see. Uh, 14. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, look. Yeah, would you I look at that? We made it. Nicely done. That was so you, guys are in the, you guys are in the lead at this point. Um, and you are going under the. Um, We're going to pull over. The 12 section. dwarves are going to get out. Yeah. <laughs> <That's> goblins. <laughs> Oh, I like, I mean, like, it'd be like 80 goblins, though, right? <laughs> so you go under the under uh, under the underpass, and you're speeding along. Um, you see some people in your rearview mirror because the goblins have made it. Um, the uh, the two monks, Bowden and Doden, have made it, so they're speeding along after you. But you're in the lead. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, I will use my turn to give you another inspiration. <laughs> not a bad idea. Like, not really a bad yeah. idea. <laughs> um, okay, Mike, make your driving check. It's 15. 15. Did anybody get the wrong key? Well, there was only one key left Ooh. when the last group came. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah, he only swapped two. 18. So. Hooray! Make it. make it. So they're probably like, this isn't the right color. This isn't the right color. So. Someone stole a key. 
It's going to take a couple rounds for the last two teams. Maybe They're next time they'll be behind same you. Color. Okay. Yeah. Um, and it'll be wrong that time. Oh. So yes. the monks, I'll make the check for the monks. They make it. Um, the gnolls, they make it. The goblins do not. They start slowing down, so you you speed past them. Um, and it, you're basically right behind these guys. Well, not right behind, but, but you I can are see them. next in order. Um, all right. Okay, so we're back to... Um, you guys. So this is again? Yeah. Cool. Let's do it. All right, are we out of a loop? Are we back down to a 10 or what? You guys what? are on the straightaway, so you have passed Hell under, yeah. and you're heading All into... right, so how do we pick up speed? What was that one? That Heading was a DC 10. Going, yeah. to, going to the tip. So is it full throw? It's this way? Yes. Ah, yeah. uh, nat 20. Woo! So that brings so me to a 25. Speeding along. Nice. Roll your um, D4. Yeah. Is What's there the D4 for? Four four is how fast we speed. Oh. Given... Four. Four. Oh, fuck. 40s. Okay, so you I drop in the low rider. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> As a matter of fact, uh, Frank, while you're going that fast, uh, go ahead and make a, another um, turn check for me. This is going to be DC 15. Uh, we're good. Okay. Because so I got an eight plus a two, and that's later five. Now, because you guys sped along, you're now around that corner. Right here? Yes. Yeah. Nice. Which wow. means I'll use my turn. So and I'll drop another. <laughs> that was a dope mm, turn. Mm, Keep mm, making dope mm, turns. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Little D night they call me D nice. Yeah. Mm. So, uh, what Ren sees is he sees another turn off coming up, and um, it's going to take uh, one more check to get there. Okay. Cool. Uh, is there anything Sarsaro wants to do? You guys are so you guys are in first place. Uh, Mike's. Uh, Cirque and uh, Xenos are in second place. Is there another. anybody? There are crews. How far away are the they? The goblins are right behind me. Yeah. Yeah, so. but they're they're more than sixty feet away. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. So I can't. I don't have anything that I can do at this point. I didn't think you point, did. So. I just wanted to make sure that yep. they're okay. So um, you know, what? I'm gonna reorganize this a little bit to actually go in order. Of the race. Of the race. <laughs> who's, in, who's in first? Look at that. Hey. I oh. feel so much better about that, guys. Yeah, that's probably a much better situation. So, um, Shipwreck. Oh, hang on, hang on. Just a second. That's you. I know. <laughs> I'm gonna make the other guys drive a check while you're doing what you're doing. I just saw what time it was. You bookie? Kind of. Um, auction. He's betting <laughs> on his own race. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna go flat out. Okay. That's a. Uh, that's only a nine. Okay, so uh, you don't go full throttle. Nope. Um, make a. Uh, well, you. They got further ahead, so they're actually quite a ways ahead yeah. of you. Yeah, they're um, there, and I'm just yeah. here. Yeah, exactly. Oh, um, okay. So um, the monks have made their driver's check, so they're on your butt. Um, the goblins start peppering you with arrows. Um, okay. Why don't you make a uh, driving check to avoid their arrows? Oh, that's 16. 16, okay. So um, nothing superficial damage, nothing really... Nothing really happened in there. Just um, the wizard gets hit. The <laughs> I got covered. The gnolls right? <laughs> actually speed past you, and oh. they they're oh. gonna make try to make their turn. Yeah, they make their turn, so they're um, they're now in second. Hey, you have something to shoot. Sure. Cool. Thank and nice. the guards have now made it to their vehicle. Nice. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> they're like, why is our key a different color? <laughs> Who know what the, what happened to the keys, you guys? Who would break the sacred rules of the race? <laughs> so, uh, Ren. All right, uh, this will get us there. So, yep. um, you guys want to attack the goblins? Oh, yeah, do you think the gnolls? Uh, we Next have the gnolls. Heat metal on the keys. Heat <laughs> <Well, laughs> metal on the steering wheel. Yeah, just the steering wheel. Okay. Uh, but I am actually going to do something to the gnolls. Uh, I'm going to cast sleep on the. Uh, how many how many gnolls are in the car? There are. Um, there are, well, you can see them there. There's five of them. Uh, there's five oh, there's gnolls. five of them? Okay, I'm not going to use sleep on them then. Yeah, that's I'm going to use it on one work. of the two vehicles or four or something like that. Um, well, then I will. Oh, that works. 
uh, as the Knolls come up, they're driving. I'm going to lean out the side and I'll be like, hey, Knolls. Oh, no. Is this the idiot's laughing? There once. <laughs> Have you ever tried to knoll around a corner? And like, oh. <laughs> you can make a wisdom it's saving, saving throw. <laughs> yeah, that's so uh, unfortunate. The driver. That's so unfortunate. Uh, natural one. <laughs> so he just goes into a fit of laughter. He's like, oh man, <laughs> hands off the wheel. They just spin right. Oh man, that's messed up. He's like, oh, that's the fuck. Oh, oh that's oh, messed it's up. It's really awful that it's like such a terrible joke. So <laughs> yeah. He just thinks it's the worst, like the most yeah. hilarious. What thing. are you gonna do? Oh, I guess they just spun oh, off. So I guess so you don't really right. need to do yeah, anything. Yeah, huh? That's fine. Yeah. All right. You start laughing. I was there. gonna do the toll of the dead, but <laughs> I'll let them do their toll thing. Toll the knoll. Yeah, toll the knoll. Uh, that is a 21 to okay. get us there. So you pull into a parking spot. Okay. Um, and you run over to, you guys hop out and run over to your, um... I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> and you just can't hide it. You're about to lose control. So... And I think he likes it. It's true. I do. Um, all right. So there's a giant, there's a giant chest. Okay. And um, it is, like you can't song. steal it and run. It is chained to. <laughs> it is chained to three poles that are in the ground. There's one. It's chained to one of the three poles, and then there's a stack of discs on top of the that are forming a pyramid. Okay. Um, so that's what you see, and then it's somebody else's turn. Um, shipwreck. You are now in second. I got a six on my driving. Okay, you are in a disadvantaged position. So you you park, but you're a super long ways away. You're gonna have to make a, a run to get to where they are. Um, the Knolls, they right themselves and they actually lose ground in doing so because they rolled like shit. So. Um, Is the one Knoll still laughing? You, How long does it last? Yeah. Real? Until he makes his check or if someone uh, attacks him. He gets attacked <laughs> if someone attacks him. So his the, buddy slaps him upside the head. Yeah. The monks make it in. The goblins well, make it in. Up to one minute is the duration. All right. Go. And the guards, you can't even see what the guards are doing, but they, they, they start getting moving. Well, they're, okay. they're trying. So we are now to you guys. Um, I am going to need you guys... Uh, Howard, can you pull your phone out and do a timer? Oh, gosh. Get it? Yup. What'd you so, get? Um, non important because you guys are playing. We'll see you later. <laughs> so, this is your puzzle. <laughs> Am I just going to do. You're going to do a timer, and this is how long it takes you guys to solve this puzzle. Okay, so I don't want a timer, I want a stopwatch. Yeah, you want a okay. stopwatch. Oh, nice. And then. For so you start what's it. What's the goal of the... So, so the in, there's a, an instruction board that is sitting right. next to the thing. Okay. Um, start the timer now? Start the timer now, because you're reading. Um, so you can move one disc at a time. You can't set um, a smaller disc on top of a large... Uh, a, a larger disc on top of a smaller disc. Okay. And you have to get um, this stack to there. there. But we can move more than one at a time. You have to move one at a time. Okay. It's terrifying. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. You can only move one at a time. Okay. So you 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 start. Okay. So Cirque, you get up there. Um, you want to do it? When do we start it? I mean, can we just start it now? Can start now. No. This Good. is how have long you ever it's going to take you. In I have. Uh, I've done it in some video games before. Bioware fucking loves this puzzle. <laughs> oh, you got you got one. I got another one. Oh, hey, look at that. Look at that. All right, so I got to start a timer now too. No. Oh. Um, so you just you just get a penalty. So now you get to start. And you and Xenos yeah. are working on there that together. There you go. Together. There you go. Yep. You're gonna have to mm -hmm. keep going that way because you're basically gonna have to move yeah. it one. Yeah. You're gonna have to move it one. You can put it over there. Yep. Oh, how do mm. you do this? Oh shit. Oh. Move that yellow one or flip that over. There you go. So everybody starts working on this puzzle. Yeah. And then move that to the third. Yep. And then that one there. Yeah. Yep. For the viewers at home. Uh, they're furiously <laughs> stacking this, and they screw Some up bitch. one. Um, it looks like Cirque is doing very well. <laughs> uh, Cirque has also played BioWare RPGs. <laughs> Red no, I've done logic puzzles slower. before. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, keep doing it. Whatever the hell you're doing. I don't know what the hell you're doing. Oh, you go all the way over. So at this oh. point, the, the monks are, the one, right? Bowden and Doden are looking at you guys, and they start doing their own puzzle. Uh -oh. um, the goblins, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, one of the goblins is eating a disc. Um, <laughs> the gnolls start I no putting the theirs doing, together. And at this point, you can hear the other, uh, the other you, car the pulling to doing, the... It's, it's too much. Um, <laughs> you try it. Because <laughs> I got backwards somehow. Okay. Um, the, so the guards at this point are pulling in and, and, and getting to the thing, and they're kind of screwed at this point. Um, we've gone two minutes now uh, in the <laughs> rounds. <laughs> it takes uh, it's so a lot I of remember, turns to do this. Um, in session zero, someone said that they wanted puzzles. That person was not here. No, no they, yeah. it was Howard. Um, oh. And so yeah, I decided I, to put you know what you're doing? world puzzles. If you think so. Unless you have a better idea. I no. Kinda, here, well, let me try it. Here. Here. Right. here. It's just yeah. takes forever. Yeah, it, it, yeah. It once takes you get to the... Time. Long time. Yeah. That way. And then that way. And then that. Yeah. What's ironic is the barbarian's going to finish. Yeah. 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 Well, get that part. the barbarian has a wizard with him. Yeah. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> That makes me feel a little bit better. Yeah, that's good. Oh, yeah, you have to do it every single time, both. Other way. Mm. Over to the far one. Yeah. And then, yeah. So this is the problem with running with puzzles on a stream, is it's going to take a while, and I didn't... Mm, uh, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I mean, you're <laughs> on the right track. So now is a good time to talk about Twitch Prime. So Twitch Prime <laughs> is a service that allows you to um, subscribe to our show, put a little uh, wind in the Dude, I have no idea what the hell's going on. And yeah. um, <laughs> you had a good go at that. And you get to give us uh, just some uh, free money, basically. If you're an Amazon Prime member, um, you can there you, go. you can switch your your you can do your account to Twitch. You're making progress. And uh, oh, subscribe to our show for free. <laughs> Um, and, um, by doing so, you give us... Is this uh, the right way? What am I doing? <laughs> that purple one's going to have to go into that tower. That's the... Um, so, do you have that tower built up? The purple's going to have to go underneath, right in between the green, I is believe. Is my Twitch Prime, which I was the first subscriber to our, our channel, um, has expired. And I had to re-up this weekend. So, if you, like me, subscribed the first week... Your Twitch Prime is probably coming up no, very soon. what the soon. hell he's doing. Have we gotten to five minutes yet? We have not gotten to five no, minutes not yet. not quite. Go all the way over. We gotta get I that purple, get purple on there. Yeah, I don't there. know what the hell's going on. Yeah! <sighs> yeah! If Michelle is watching this, she's probably embarrassed for me. <laughs> Somebody said they wanted puzzles. Well, I just, I, my brain actually turns off when people start talking. Uh, <laughs> no, seriously, which, it does. Which yeah. is so, bad on a, uh, t a show. <laughs> well, it's bad on a, <laughs> on a show where there's multiple people talking. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. But I'm trying to fill dead air. Yeah. <laughs> right, which. We're yeah. at five minutes. All right, what happens now? <laughs> okay, so you guys are able to pull away. You don't, you're not first. You're now third. In, okay. In nice. the, and the second. I, you the guys, goblins figured this out? I got yeah. farther than you did. <laughs> what? <laughs> Listen, man. I couldn't get this purple one over. Um, the, like, in the right way. So the subhuman goblins? The, <laughs> the goblins are, are now in second. Uh, Bowden and Doden are in first. What? <laughs> and then it's, uh, then it's you guys and then Sir. So we are moving on. So you sure it was the goblins? It wasn't like the monks or anyone else? The monks other... are in first. The monks okay. are in first. Okay, and, and what about like the guards or anyone else other than the guards? <laughs> yeah. They're, you they're have stumped. To transfer one whole thing over and then do the whole... It's just... So, um, you guys are speeding along. Yeah. Um, and Cirque is behind you guys. This is why working in where I work kind of sucks right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, trying to code and then having like... 14 sales calls Make going on. Make a driving check. It's like, oh! Uh, what do I need? 10? This is uh, easy. A straight one? Yeah. Yeah, 11. Cirque's still confused, so I got a 5. Okay, so you you don't get going start. You kind of fishtail for a little bit. 
in the gravel. I'm like, the, pur the prick and then and, the poop uh, and then the, oh! Yeah, let's see here. The monks, they do fine. The goblins are kind of fishtailing as well. Um, How far away are we from both cars? Um, you can probably, at this point, you just not 30 feet. Should go, 30 you? feet from yeah. both cars? Yeah. Okay, uh, and the monks are in first and the goblins are in second? Yep. Uh, in the monk car, I'm going to cast sleep. Okay. So how many hit points of... Damn. How many times did I roll? Uh, that was the fourth, fourth one, right? Yeah. You got one more? Yeah. 21 hit points worth of creatures go to sleep. 21 hit points worth. So you, um, you see uh, Doden in yeah. the sidecar just be like... Oh. All right. He had the least. It was a kind of a gamble, which I had the least, but eh. So, um, uh, Howard, what is Sarsarol doing? Uh... All right, we're, so we're close to anybody else right yeah, now? We're yeah, 30 we're 30 feet, feet from the lead. And if you can do something to the driver of the monk, his buddy that can help him out is asleep right now. Okay, so, so I can try tolling the dead on the monk. Okay. Uh, except that he's going to have a great save against A that. wisdom save. If you're doing wisdom save, that's fine. But do you have something that like messes with somebody? The, other the car or something like that? The car or something that would mess him up? Because his buddy, who would normally be there to like wake him up or snap him out of it, isn't there, is out he's right now. He's sleeping. I don't really. I mean, anything else would be concentration, and I'm using my concentration still to give him the bonus. Yeah, then don't right. worry about it. Well, then I would, I, would use the toll, I would use the toll on the goblins, then, instead of the monks. Okay, so yeah. the goblin driver needs to make a wisdom save. Okay. Has he taken damage or no? He has taken damage. Okay. Does he make a save? He does not make okay. a save. And he takes six damage. Okay, he takes six damage, and he has to make a extra uh, save, and he doesn't, so he's kind of skidding. Um, so you pull ahead of them. Perfect. So now it's just Bowden and Doden that you're behind. Mm -hmm. um, I forgot which way I'm going. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm, I'm there Mike? with you, pal. I'm <laughs> 17 on my driving. Okay, time. so you, d you drive just fine. Uh, let's see Shit, where was it? <laughs> <laughs> Leave that shit alone. Okay, so this is, you're Drum now to the, so the spiraling. Okay. Area, so it goes up in like a, uh, a spiral. This is going to be a difficult check. Um, I'm going to tell you that up front, um, in case you want to do anything about that. Um, does Doden get to make a sleep saving uh, throw every round or no? Mutual. Each creature affected by the spell falls unconscious until the spell ends, which is one minute. Or until, someone, until, until wakes someone wakes him up. Okay. So if the driver didn't want to pull a stunt and wake him up instead, he could. Yeah, he doesn't want to do that. All right. Well, I mean, the option's available for him. <laughs> so um, what you see, actually, is the monks slow way down. They actually, you guys speed past them as they slow way down. But they, <laughs> they make the turn doing so. Um, what do you guys want to do? Uh, make the turn. Okay. This is a Howard. DC 20. <laughs> I'm... On the last pay. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! That sucks. That sucks. That missed it by it? one. That so it by let's one. see. 18, 19. That's right, right? Athletics is five. Yep, 19. Okay. So you guys kind of fishtail out. You still make the turn, but the, the monks who slowed way down jet yeah. past you. Uh, the goblins. And uh, the monks are gen past us. Yep. We still have our turn, right? Yeah. Uh, so he's turning. The other dude's still asleep in yep. the car. Yep. He can go ahead and make a wisdom saving throw. <laughs> the driver. Okay. Um, that was a 19. 19? Yeah. 19. Okay. Uh, Sarsarell, are you going to do anything as the monks jet past you? Uh, he woke. He didn't wake him up, right? No, he didn't wake him up. He just... Is leaving. I mean, I, sleepy like most of my stuff is going to be against their saves, which are going to be pretty good, I'm yeah. afraid. So I don't think I'll be able to do much. Okay. Because I don't have enough do direct you wanna, damage. So the goblins are uh, trying to get past you as well. Do you want to focus yeah, on the I'll, goblin? Yeah, I'll do another toll on the goblin. Okay. So he's going to make Or do you want to do 
I mean, that's oh, like a, a thunder lot of wave. All together. Are they all right next to us? I mean, they're in a, they're in a vehicle. <clears throat> all right. Thunder. I think we're gonna do a thunder, thunder wave. wave. Okay. All right. So that's a Constitution saving throw. It is. And it is versus what? Uh, the DC is a fourteen. Okay. But so, I'm gonna maximize it. Yeah, sure. You are. Um, so, harangue makes it. Okay. What's the maximized? Sixteen damage. So it does not matter if the goblins make it or not because they die. <laughs> That's awesome. So what you see That's awesome. is the bus is making its turn, and then just the inside of the bus goes red. <laughs> Everywhere red as this boom happens. And um, he's going to have disadvantage on his check. Because <laughs> his say, cousin's it's... gunk is all but over him. Mm -hmm. What he does is he... Um, Instead of trying to make the turn after the, the thing goes flashes red, you hear like screeching as um, as he um, he just hits the brakes and it goes nur, 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 before it even gets to the turn. Um, <laughs> sir, so you see this bud this bus just flash with blood as this boom happens and. Um, the, uh, and it basically screeches to a stop, and you fly right by it. Now make your. Uh, so this I'm gonna hit on the brakes, and they'll fly right you're by. You're going me. full speed. I'm it's a DC 20. Uh, if you, no. If I'm gonna, you slow down, it's a 15. I'm gonna slow down to get around it because I can't. Okay. I don't think I can make a 20. Uh, that's a 12. Okay. So you um, you also kind of fishtail out, but you make the turn. Okay. With your slowing down. Uh, the goblins, or the gnolls and the, yeah, the gnolls and the guards are, are kind of creeping up towards you, Mike. You kind of see them okay. uh, making their way around the bus. It is the monk's turn. He's driving. And uh, you guys. So you guys are now, he's pulled ahead a little bit because mm -hmm. he's in a faster vehicle. Mm -hmm. You guys are now about 50 feet away. And we can do... Um, it's a straightaway again, right? Yeah, you're now, you've passed that. So at this point, so um, at this point, and I was going to tell this to Mike, but I, you guys are going to get there first. Um, that, that curly cue at the end there, you can jump that, and you save two turns off of oh, the... Oh, really? Yeah. What's a jump? What's the check on a jump? It's 20. It's a 20. You have Jump it, vehicle stunts only a 15. Oh, okay. It's a 15. Oh, really? Oh, then okay. I'll do that shit. All right. So you get to this, and you, if you can, you'll be in first place. And we're we're at the turn right now, right? We're about... You're at the point where you could make your jump. Okay, cool. Uh, I Hit him! I cast heat metal on the wheel of the monk's car. Okay. Uh, it it just starts fishtailing all over the yeah, place. Yeah, it does. And that lasts for a minute if you have it. So they're going to that. immediately drop back into this spot. Yeah, that's a uh, 19. So you jump. Well, you know them <laughs> boys are Them Duke the boys! Them Duke, them Duke, them Duke boys! There's a freeze frame. <laughs> <-hee>. A commercial <laughs> break. <laughs> and then you land. <laughs> and at this point, all you have to do is, on the, your next turn, all you have to do is stop your vehicle in time. And you're to the... Um, the end of the race, and um, at this point, you have to use your key. You, well, you will have to use your key to unlock your chest, and um, okay. And then that will be the last challenge. All right. So you just have to make that one check. And so when I head towards there, I'm like, if anybody comes, kill them. Absolutely. Uh, Treat them like a goblin. <laughs> no. Oh no! This is the goblins. The goblins see what you did, and they try to do the same. The one goblin who stopped well, because the one goblin yeah. is still driving. Yeah. yeah. For his goblin brothers. Well, actually, he can't. No, I'm sorry, he can't because he stopped. He stopped. So yeah. he gets going again, and he has to go. He can't pick up enough speed to make the jump. Uh, Mike, I'm gonna go for the jump. Go jump. Go okay, so it's a DC 15. 15. Can I rage while jumping? That's awesome! Yeah! <laughs> I'm glad natural I one. Natural one or three. Dude! I don't know what the you Well, 
I have, can't, I have yet to get inspiration in this game, so I'm going to go with the 10. Okay. So, no, like, since session one. Oh. Because starting a bar fight's my thing. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Um, and we've been in one bar. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, roll a 2d6 for me. Six. Okay. I think that's what you got last time. Uh, everybody takes 1d6 damage. Four. So you land really rough. And you and Xenos, it's like Terminator 2 style rough. Um, and you you both take some damage as you land. Um, but you make it, and um, the what you see is the other guys are having to go around the circle. So they it's going to take them some time to catch up to you. Um, so at this point, they're going to go slow and make their way around it. You guys have now got two turns uh, to unlock your chests. And Howard, you may want to stop that puzzle because um, when you what? unlock your chest... Is there another puzzle? There's another puzzle. <laughs> another puzzle. Um, so, oh, I'm better at these. Um, you may want to unhook your mic All right. and come over on this side because this is what you got. Um, Excellent. Mm. Point Doug, out. I want to thank you for not showing up tonight because uh, Mike gets to solve this puzzle by himself. <laughs> and and this one. And Do I one. start the timer again? Yeah, start the timer. Okay. Fracking. Frickin' frac. There you go. Here we go. So this is just a puzzle. It's just a puzzle. Because somebody said that they wanted puzzles. Don't oh. worry, guys. I made it to our New York side of the office. <laughs> <laughs> So fortunately, it's a picture, and we'll be able to figure it out. It's a damn beholder. Yeah, it is. So it's, of course it's a picture. Yes. Oh. No, it's a picture of uh, Lord Rundice. Yeah, yeah, clearly. That's a beholder gut. That's a beholder eye. Okay. So again, uh, Twitch Prime, it will allow us <laughs> to get some, some money from okay. your Amazon Prime subscription. It is free with your Amazon Prime subscription. So you can, while you can subscribe to any channel, we are the most entertaining channel Here's a nice that you thought. could possibly see. Here's and, uh, you know, I mean, it's a good That's deal. Be the lower it, it gives us a little bit of money, and um, okay, we need small. money because uh, buying puzzle games for everyone to put together, it's not free. Um, it does cost money to do that. Um, and I would like to point out that <laughs> neither neither team solved here. their puzzle yet. So I saved you from watching those. Um, there was yeah. half of this Good time. So at this point, uh, Lord Rundines, Rundines is out and he's, oh, he's there, looking over you guys and he's oh, like, oh, someone's going to win. Someone's putting it together. Who could it be? Ooh, Zerk is putting his puzzle together very quickly. It looks like he might be closer along than everybody else. And at this point, the teams are kind of pulling in, and they're starting to do I'm going to go turn into a bear and kill them. <laughs> <laughs> one of the, one of the teams goes that's... to put its lock in the thing, and it doesn't necessary. work. Um, <laughs> I turn into a bear and scare them as they come up. Because I'm not going to really help it with make, the puzzle uh, itself. Make an intimidation check. And then this is... There's more of that column oh, somewhere. <laughs> so, so in bear it, form, 13. I'm 13. roaring. Okay. All right. You you oh, scared a uh, team away from what they're Sorry doing. Sorry if I'm typing because I, I don't have room over here. To solve a puzzle? Yeah. <laughs> Physically don't have the room. Uh, so if you want more enjoyment like this, pledge now. That goes there, <laughs> yep. 100%. Just have a read. Yeah. Oh, you're so close. You're so close. But Mike is Mike is solving it just as quickly. Well, yeah, but that's Mike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. Mike's got another piece. He's getting close. Like that. <laughs> this is here. Are you sure that I don't have part of Howard's pieces? No, there you go. I'm positive there it is. because when I was cutting That's these the last out, one. There you go. I put them together. Um, I put them together. That don't make any damn sense. That one. 
No, because it's not the heading totally next one. Hang on. Let me move this off of the map. Right? Like, that matches up perfectly. Yeah. <laughs> he ain't got no third eyeball. Who cares? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Is that right? I don't think I've got So, at this, this point, the right. goblins are starting to solve their puzzle. Unless I'm going to eat a goblin. <laughs> There's only one goblin yeah. left. There's only one left, but he's starting to put sure? it together. So Do you want to make an attack? Yep. Yeah. Well, I'm going to attack him. All right. That goes right there. Uh, bear there. form. Yeah. First no, attack a is a 13. a 13. Oh, no, no. No, I take that back. Yeah, 13. Uh, actually, 13 does not hit. I'm sorry. Second but attack. He's going well, to attack you. And misses. He's going to attack you twice, too. Okay. And then this goes so he got a 20 hit. and a 13, which probably doesn't hit. No, 13 hits. Okay, uh, so two hits. That? All right, hold on. This is sword. Nope, that sword that's sword. Yeah. Uh, 18 damage. Okay. And this is right here. 11 damage. Okay. okay. This is right. All right, so I'll swing again. Okay, go ahead. Uh, that will also be another 13, which misses. And that will also miss. Okay. I'm stalling the goblin, guys. Kill some shit. Because they're really good at puzzles. <laughs> <laughs> He's just standing there and I'm bored. They are. Yeah. Just trying to figure out how this all fits. Oh, thanks. <laughs> well, it didn't matter. It was just an issue. Were you showing him how to fucking solve? There we go. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Like two done. months ago. You got it. All right. All right, I'm going to head back to our L.A. office. <laughs> um, I blame Doug for not being here. That's right. And Sorry, I didn't want to cheat. Fair. Didn't want to cheat. Yeah. I've, he sent me the picture two months ago. I didn't oh. send it two months ago. It was like two weeks ago. I only came up with this like several weeks ago. So <laughs> anyway, so Ren, Sarsarel, and, uh, and Vizago are declared the winners. Hooray! Woo! Um, and uh, Lord Rundais yes. turns to you and he says, Congratulations! I turn back into human form. Oh, shit, I wasn't even close. <laughs> <laughs> you have won the Rattle Bolt Cup. Let's get us the hell off this island. As I figured we would because what it's our destiny to be here. Can I grant you? Get us the hell off this island. To explore this island and leave once we have completed our divine quest. That is two. Then bye. <laughs> hey, um, you remember Later. Champion? Right and we're leaving. The right to take our findings from our expedition with us when we finish it. Sure. No, 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 no. You're not speaking mm -hmm. for the group. What makes you think you're speaking for the group? Well, we're leaving. If we can't and explore and we're leave, leave, then we're leaving. Yeah. Why don't you make a persuasion check? How, how what about if this? I make a Vizago take make that persuasion check? Yeah. Okay. You sure can. Hey, um, yeah, you can I you talk assist to if I assist because I am trained in it, I give you advantage. Sure. Yes. You can have advantage. Okay. And if you'd like to inspire yourself, you could also okay. do that. I'm right. out Rifle of man brings up a good point. Uh, so that why is don't you turn into an eagle? You're such a bear. I don't span. have a fly. I, <laughs> I don't have a fly yet. But funny, man. Funny, do funny. <laughs> Chicago, Chicago bear form. <laughs> 17. Ooh, no more bear, no more bear. <laughs> he says that he is willing to, um, he is willing to offer you the ability to um, explore the island mm -hmm. or take one of the treasures that, um, that Xenos uh, bargained for. And once you're done exploring, you can leave the island. So you can do one or the We will explore. We don't want We don't want a treasure from the stores. We gotta figure out why we were sent here. Uh, can we do- We there... were sent here for treasure. Yeah, we were sent here for treasure. So that's why I'm like- But, Sarsar, we, we, a... we have to defeat the mechanical creature that was in what? my dream. Is there a what check I can make to see about? whether I would I know you what sort of dream. things might be on the island, considering we spent like a week here hanging out? Sure. Um, what? <laughs> make, a, make a history. History? Okay. No. <laughs> uh, da, 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 that is going to be 15. 15? So you know that there, you know that there are robot dinosaurs on this island. Mm -hmm. And Sarsarel, in the week that you've been here, has mm -hmm. described to you a dream where he slew a robot dinosaur 
and was able to take treasure off of it. What kind of treasure? It was some rod. It was a. Uh, That's it. Half we want to bounce. And what treasures <laughs> does he have in his vault? It was half of like. He said we get a pick. Oh, so half. I oh, half. asked yeah. Runa if I can make another deal. Weapon. I, in my dream, I thought it might be maybe a get the second. I'm really. Do you want to provide other entertainment? Um, I can provide you the means of getting entertainment. What is the what is this deal? So, just let me can let me talk to my crewman over here first. Okay, so you all huddle up. Huddle yeah. Up. Okay. So, um, do you remember the whole Zeno stands in the middle. Lord, the whole Dragon Queen. Horde, yes. Yeah, how so they're gonna? Have they wanted to come here to raid and pillage and get mm -hmm. some stuff? Mm -hmm. You know, there's a black dragon born here that was part of the Dragon Queen. Maybe he was their scout. Could possibly. Maybe we can tell Rundai that he actually has a traitor, and we're actually Ooh. helping him Ooh. and saving him. And for an extra favor. For an extra favor. Or maybe they're also after the divine weapon. Well, the you and the goddamn divine weapon. The cult of the Dragon <laughs> Queen knows about the island that there's great treasures yes. here. Yeah. Yeah. They have an inside man who is the right hand of the guy that's ruling the place. Yeah. He's going to kill Rundai's. He's not going to kill Rune Dines. Oh, yes, he will. Yeah, I don't think that's try. the treasure that they're looking for. The treasure that they're looking for probably isn't one that it's he has the... in the... In the... Yeah, Zeno but says either describe way, what's he doesn't there. want people There's taking away stuff. stuff without providing him entertainment so, first. I want to have... Uh, you gonna betray? I'm going to use um, Vasago to make that persuasion. Yeah. So I, I'll go up and I'll bring it. <laughs> <laughs> nice. In case we need it. Okay. That's good. Um... So I'll come up and I'll be like, the great lord, uh, I will give you, in exchange for both of these things that I ask, I will give you information that will save your island, okay. your treasure, and I'll throw in one extra thing for the two things I'm asking you, okay. more entertainment for you of how you can dispose of this oh, thing. Oh, okay. And then he's going to wink. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It wouldn't so be right so if you well didn't wink. Oh, uh, that's 17 plus 7. Uh, it's pretty damn pretty good. Pretty, yeah. pretty damn good. 24. Okay, so he is willing to hear you out. And uh, I'll, I'm going to go up and I'm going to... Even better. Gonna I'll tell it to him through message oh, okay. internally. Right. And then I'll laugh and point at the Black Dragon Board. <laughs> so the Black Dragon Board gets real, <laughs> real sketched out when you point at him. And uh, there is an eye ray that hits him and he just crumples to dust. <laughs> nice. Did you guys know I lost awesome. that spell? <laughs> the, and then I wink. <laughs> no. So, um, you don't do that again. Before we end tonight, so uh, next next week you guys will be exploring the island of Lorath. All right. What we're here for. What you're here for. <laughs> and we have the ability to leave. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and and you we get to grab that thing. You get to pick one, from one of his treasures. Yeah. Right. Right now. Oh. Uh oh. Without Xenos. Without Xenos here. Without Zenos here. No. Oh, he's he's gonna be furious in 14 so, seconds. So. <laughs> yeah, 14 seconds. <laughs> the, the treasures that you get to pick from. Mm -hmm. There is what looks like what we would think of as a, a stop a timepiece. Um, it has an eye on well, the cover, a decorative does. eye. It's a pocket watch. It tells um, me. there is a. Probably like the length of your forearm type um, metal cylinder, um, but it has all of these um, doodads at the end that come out and uh, that little arms that have balls on the ends of them. Um, and uh, Runai says that that is a uh, control rod. Um, it's not working super great at the moment. Mm -hmm. um, Hello. You got anything under control? Yes. Yeah. Um, we <laughs> you <Nope>. have <laughs> a a cone with a little handle on it, uh -huh. um, and um, it looks like it could amplify amplify your voice. It's <gasps> pretty good. Or so there is this uh, this. It looks like a hand crossbow, but instead of um, the crossbow part it just has the cylinder out the top and then there is a a larger um a larger cylinder that's sitting on the top of it that you could maybe look through it like a sight mm. looks kind of like this <laughs> 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 so what would you like to choose 
I'm, what is, is that a universal That cone remote? looks real cool. Well, that, yeah, what is the, the cylinder rod? that has all the, the little... The control rod they said wasn't working very well. But it, maybe it, it looks like uh, it looks like this. Hmm. Now, if I were to if I were to look at that cone a little bit more. Well, you to... he's not going to allow you to. Can I can I just can I just thing. see the pictures of all of them? Yeah. So there's this timepiece. Okay. There's Han Solo's blaster. Uh -huh. uh, there is what looks like a megaphone. And um, then cool. you saw the control rod. So. Yeah. Well, I mean. Now, all right. How many? There's five things. There's four. There's four things. Four, four things. things. All right. So D4? we got this D4 here. Yeah, I was gonna say, Cirque's, right. Cirque's gonna vote for <laughs> number one. Number one. Which is the stopwatch. Which is the stopwatch. Mm -hmm. All right. So Vizago's really only interested in two things. Or, well, what? Is, what is? What do you want? You want the megaphone? The megaphone. The stopwatch does look kind of interesting, and then. Um, what do you yeah. look at? Okay. So megaphone who, probably. Who here? So you, Aaron's gotten, uh, the Zago has gotten treasure. Oh, yeah, maybe. Cirque. I, have, I haven't seen. I it has yet. a necklace <laughs> yeah. that lets me breathe underwater. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am immortal. I've got shot. the wind fan. Okay, so you've yeah. gotten treasure. I've and gotten the mithril armor. It's not magical. Mm. What? What those things could he use? Yeah. Probably the rod. Probably the rod, the rod of controlling dinosaurs. <laughs> I say go for the rod. Yeah, but what if we get there and it only sort of works? I mean, that's not something you want to turn well, on. Well, yeah. if it sort of works so, long enough to... I will say that each one of these is a magical item. I've thrown a technology spin on them. Uh -huh. So um, the malfunctioning part of the the rod, it functions as the, the magical item that it's supposed to be. Okay. So um, let's go for the rod. Unless <laughs> Genos is voting for the fart gun, I think he means dart gun. But there might have been an autocorrect. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what hold on. Is there a doing? fart gun? Because it's so fuck. <laughs> oh, <there's other> <laughs> <laughs> the megaphone looks like a fart gun from. It's true. Domain. It does look like a fart. What gun. are you guys gonna go with? Uh, well, I, I mean, I I don't know. I would go for the megaphone, but that's because I'm greedy and I'm role playing a greedy character. I think we should go for the rod, the, for the rod, the control rod. I, rod. Two votes. Rod. rod. Okay. Okay. Cool. So what you get is a malfunctioning control rod. This rod has seven charges. While holding the rod, you can spend an action to expend one of the charges and choose a target within 120 feet of you. The target creature, ob, uh, an object, or point in space. Um, you roll a d100 on a table and consult the following table to discover what it happens. So oh, technology. Technology-wise, it is a malfunctioning control rod. What you actually have is a wand of wonder. Oh! <laughs> I want to see that. So I didn't print out the table because we the table can. is like... Oh, it's down. insane. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, okay, it's fun. Yeah. so malfunctioning There's control. some good things, some bad things. Yes. If yeah. guys are still, uh, so thank you, everybody. Uh, I hope you enjoyed our show. If you, um, if you have subscribed and you want to support us, please renew your subscription. It would help us out a lot. Mm -hmm. And with that... We will leave you until next week. When we explore the island. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>